What were you? We can touch each other. Yeah. We're brothers. We haven't <laughs> fought yet, though. And we normally do. So maybe tonight's the night, guys. You did yell at our mom a lot today. Well, she fucked up a lot today. <laughs> um, I hope everyone is doing well. Um, I want to give a shout out right now. We have this set up. Um, I was trying to reach out to everybody over the last two weeks. Um, and first of all, can you guys hear us? Are we good? This is a new mic situation. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, so we got everybody involved that we were doing this trailer thing with, but we are missing a person. Schwingles came in at the, at the very last minute, so he was able to get you. Have you guys ever seen the movie The Wizard? You ever see The Wizard? Yeah. There's a part in The Wizard where they're doing video game Armageddon. And the kid, Josh, I think it's Josh, right, is the kid's name? And California? Yeah, guy. yeah. And they're doing the, the finals, and he's in the finals, but they can't find him because he's being chased by this guy. And they're, they're doing the contest, and they go... I forget what, it's not Josh Baskin, that's uh, big. They go, the guy says his name like a couple times and finally he shows up in the, th so that's what we're doing right now. We're like, Christina Marie, Christina Marie, Christina Marie, are you there? She still has time. Shringles came in at, at the very last minute. Um, so you guys did see. Um, who we have in the intro, Christine, where we haven't been able to get in touch with, so hopefully she's okay. Um, but so if you guys don't know, can I get ones in the chat if you've seen Trailer Boys, and can I get twos if you have not seen Trailer Boys? Because I want to know if we're if we have to explain this or not, you know what I'm saying? Twos if you're a new viewer, eight sleeve McDickle. That wasn't an option, sleeve mid, sleeve McDickle. Oh, All right. For those of you who haven't seen Trailers Boys, my name is Nate Browns. This is Sam Brown. He's Hello. a trailer boy. You may recognize him for such sketch comedy groups such as um, Teenage Trouble. Teenage Trouble. I uh, I I had a little bit to do with the whitest kids you know. What's look that? Oh, look at the burn. I had a little bit to do with it. Dang. Even uh -uh. though we've had the this is now on YouTube. Trailer Boys is on YouTube. We have one on YouTube, so... And it has, like, four comments, and one of this, the comments is, I don't know why this is on the channel. None of these people have anything to do with the whitest kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's great! Yeah. Well, I definitely don't. So you're, 50% of that's right. I mean, right. you're in an episode. Don't tell anybody. They'll find the it. The live one. Um, from here down. I was very... You wouldn't recognize me today, because... I was much skinnier then. But did we get free Slurpees today? No, and I'm upset. Is, was it today Wait, free? Christina Marie's here. Christina Marie. It's just like the thing. The the uh, wizard. Yeah, Christina Marie. Okay, you're in. Okay. You're in. Okay. Christina Marie, check your messages because there's an email address and I want you to email me a trailer. Wow. Wow. This is some real drama. Some RD. I'm gonna write her name down on the on the random drawing thing. Ew, Will Smith's dad trying to have me get you murdered. What did Will Smith's okay. dad say? Just Holy some bullshit shit. boring that trash per use. Trying to get attention oh. from me. I don't know if Christine Marie's even on Discord, but we got everyone else on Discord. Christine Marie, send me an email with a trailer, and um, this is how we're going to do it. We have a full What's your email address? Everybody. Uh, it's secret, Hi, and I gave it out to Christine Marie in chat. I think so. If you didn't get it, Christine Marie, uh, uh, that was for you. Um, is that rude? No, it was perfect. Okay. Okay. What? Yes. Thanks okay, for the okay. sub, Schwangles. Right. You're playing tonight, right? Yeah. Good. Okay. <gasps> Will Smith, Dad. All right. Trash. It's black on black. You can't see it. So this is the cowboy hat you may recognize from Hi, the Greg. Greatest Hits episode. 
but it's invisible because it's black on black. Here's uh, what we're doing, guys. Um, we have been doing one whole season of watching trailers and kind of giving them points. And, you know, uh, we were like, what are we going to do? And Sam was like, we should do a tournament. We should we should do a tournament eventually. And so we were like, let's let's get into it. Let's do the tournament. So we figured out a weird kind of bracket thing. Um, Sam's pulling some stuff up now. We're trying to organize it. I'm not the organizer guy. I couldn't even figure out the Gooby point system. We found, we found, what we did was we came up with. We came up with, they came up with this on a car ride from the beach today. No. Six months ago we came up with this. Yeah, six months ago. Of the process? We refined it today. We yeah. definitely refined it. Because we're working up to the last second. Because we're working. <laughs> you know, like, we're, so we're hard. always... You guys are working. Yeah, you're never you done until trying to make, de the make deadline. is out there. Look yeah. at the sunburn, dude. It's a mess. It looks awful on Is it camera. hot? Yeah, it's hot. <laughs> Although! So, I got, like... I spent the day under a towel um, at the beach watching uh, the England-Italy game on my phone and forgot, like, one arm was just totally uncovered. So, uh, congratulations to you, Legion Italia. May all your favorite players get diarrhea tonight. Allegra, I just think it's a more fun choice. Okay. Here's how we go. Who's Here's in the tournament. What we're going to do is... Should we, sh vibe. should we show last week's winner first? Yeah, like, yeah, that's explain good. Explain the tournament. All right, so... Um, so I can send you this now. I just want to... Let's. We're going to do a quick tech test. You know, when we do on Trailer Boys... We have to test the technology, um, and we're going to be up on this screen, y'all. So see the way where we look like this up here? On the screen, it's actually following our heads when we go like this to look. See? That's okay, happening. That? All right. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to be talking shit over this trailer, and we want you guys to know, we want to hear if you guys know what we're saying, if you can hear what we're saying. Right? Does that make sense? This is last week's winner. Some people hated this in chat. Sandra you know? Porter, hopefully the next White House. You haven't seen this yet. My name, on the other hand, is. This is amazing. Cool. Speaking of Italy, is this porn? Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United That's States him? of America. Where can we see our also, is the speaker the inhaler going and, uh, through the mic? The can you guys hear uh, the, the, the sound reverbing? Run a test to make sure. The governor speaks very highly of you. Give me his name, and I'll have him transferred to Alaska. They say I'll die with <laughs> Wheel of Money didn't like this. I have something very important to read you. It's the trailer oh, wants to be a bit louder. Bomb okay. can't see, sir. Shit! These have micro antennas, so they easily could have left the room and then triggered the bombs. All right, there are eleven bombs. That's cool. Yeah, we just didn't want. And they've been activated by remote not control. Not on headphones because it's real, so we want the speakers I'm on. But I don't know if the speakers are. Have you noticed it today? I'm always right. We're trapped I, in here, huh? I got a new so mic for seen, this. Sir, Where to begin, this. Mr. President? 100%. The terrorist right. bomb would explode too, sir. How um, did the if bombs you haven't seen get this in the Oval Office? office. Yeah, Everyone, turn their phone off! I can't take it! Ms. Porter, please calm down. Calm down my ass, Mr. President. Are your real names at all? So you two the are fighting! Sandra Porter, that's not even a real name. Show us your ID. President Carroll! <laughs> Now someone spoken. Yeah, the music is just fucking loud on Mr. This President, anyway. could you please explain what's happening to us? Correct, Mark. What? At least one billion people want the President of the United States that. No! President! No! No! <laughs> Oddly, though, this is one of the sexier trailers we have watched. With the stalking thing, you know? That was kind of hot. This cannot oh. be real. I downloaded this. I acquired this in a legal way because I heard it's ridiculous. So I was like, uh, uh, we only really get to see. I was like, oh, they gave the whole trailer away. And somebody was like, no, you have no idea what's involved there. So um, I'll let Sam explain how... Do you want to explain how we're going to do it, or do you want me to do... All right, we're going to show you how we're going to do it, right? Is that the plan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. One second. Um, 
You think the trailer should be louder? As a. Um, we'll figure it out. We'll, we'll, you know, we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. Um, but let me just show you who's involved in this round. Um, generally, the first round is going to be broken up into two groups of five, I think, right? I don't want to show the graphic, but I just wanted to show. So, Christina Marie. There, we have two a group stage, which is two groups of five. Schwingles. Niamics. Kit Black with two T's. Avalanche Fan 84. Legion Italia. There's no theme, right? No theme. No, no theme. theme, babe. Professor Marth Live. Oh, it was Professor Marth Love. Zombie Bender. No, not that guy. It's full Panwall. Subclown. Flanja. I think I got everybody. Does that sound like everybody? Sounds like everybody. Yeah, that's. Yeah. I think that's everybody. It's, what is it? It's, is it 10? It's 10. It should be yeah, 10. Yeah, that's I what 10? I thought. I thought okay. it was 10. Um, okay. Sorry. What? Sorry. They said turn the phones off. It's a my tear. alarm. Hi, Lep. All right. Nate. Yeah, bud. Sending you the picture now. Mm hmm. All right, one sec. Should be in your Gmail. Um, Sent it from your Gmail. From my Gmail? To, to my your Gmail? Gmail, yeah. You hacked my computer? Yeah. Cool. Wow. Hacking sick. <laughs> okay. All right. This beautiful graphic <laughs> um, is. Did you make that? This is. I made this all by myself. Sam. That's beautiful. It's, it's amazing. <laughs> it's really pretty. It looks very Good job. You're hyping this up, so people are going to be like really Ooh. expecting something crazy. Yeah, no, I made this. It took me about... Driftwood. Four weeks. Okay. This is definitely one of my projects. It made me learn Photoshop a little bit better. Uh, a little bit best? It looks great. I think he is. I like the colors. Yeah, thank you. Ooh, look at this colorful. <laughs> oh, wait, it's not up yet. It's not up yet. They're going to, oh, you can't see it. Transition, right. bro. Oh, oh you're going to fix gotta, it. Yeah, fix yeah, it. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so this is how it works. Resident Steveful. We're going to have two group, two group stages. And that's two groups of five. You guys will vote on all the, the, all five trailers. The two top picks go on. Those are winners. Everyone else, I get. It says two winners, two losers. It will be two winners, three losers. Actually, okay. It's a little mistake. So, uh, so we're gonna do two group stages. Vote on them. Everyone who's a loser, then we'll have a loser group. So all those people will play each other. Is that six? Is that too many people? No, I okay. don't think so. You can vote on six things, or is it five? Five. All right, we'll have to figure that out. Wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you can only vote on five, I think. You can only vote on five. Yeah. So one person, the absolute bottom loser, gets eliminated. From the first two rounds? From the first two rounds. Ooh, Agreed, we, Wheel. We will pick someone to make an enemy for life. <laughs> we... Not me. Here, us three... We'll pick one of you to just crush your dreams. You get one trailer, and that's it, Bozo. And then we have a loser group. And then so all the losers, we get to see what their crap is. See the, what the loser crap is. And then we'll pick the two best craps. Everyone else, we kill. They're dead. They're not, al they're not alive anymore. Okay? And then starts the head-to-head -head round. And we have winner of group one play the loser winner. And we have the winner of group two play the loser runner-up. And then we have the runner-up of group one play the runner-up of group two. 
And so we have three winners there, three losers there. You lose there, you're out. See you later, bud. You're dead. You win there, you're on to the round of three. And we have three people go up. They each show one trailer. The top two from the round of three go on. You lose there, you get the bronze. No one likes you. No one likes the bronze. Get over it. I like you. And then... We do the championship round, one-on-one, -on -one. you each show a trailer, we vote after each, uh, after the first two, and then we vote after the second two, and we add, it's aggregate scoring at that point. Well, you're in charge of that, because as everyone knows, I got confused by the Gooby point system, so um, that's, it's all you. Um... I also want to mention that normally it's like the points are kind of weighted where chat as uh, as, a, <laughs> as a whole gets equal points, equal votes is like us it's individually. Us. But the way this is working is we are voting in chat as well. You have your phones on you. Yes, we, can vote. we will vote on chat. So, we are one of you. You have as m until except we have the to to kill the person. I thought you said I got to have power vote by Monster well, Energy we get, Drink. We get to kill someone though. Oh. After the I wanted a round. power boat vote. You power, want I want a power, power boat. boat. Also, I want to say this, guys. Um, the trophy store um, is on vacation, and they have been closed, but they open tomorrow. So we were like, let's get real trophies for this, and found a local trophy shop. But uh, they've been closed. So we'll have something. We'll get it engraved. It'll be fun. I wish I had something to show you. Oh, the names. Oh, but um, we'll, we'll figure canceled. out next time. Yeah, we'll, we'll get something out there. It'll be fun. You'll get it in the mail. I'll pay for it out of my own pocket because I think this is fun. All right. Um, do you this. want to... It's it's uh, that one, that one, that one, that one. Okay. All right. Um, so, do you want to add... Do you want to... We'll, we'll start doing group one. Yeah, let's start with group one. Should we just fill out group one all the way or should we go back and forth group one, group two? It's table. All right, uh... We should just fill out group one. Right? Fill out group one. All right. So here's what group one's is going to be. Okay. First person in group one, Kit Black. Woo! You want to pick the next person? Yeah. I marked one of these with chewing gum. Big mistake. Zombie. Zombie Bender. Zombie Bender. Do you want to pick one? I froze one so I can feel it. It's colder <laughs> than the other one. So I can feel it. And the one I froze was Nyamix. Nyamix. And number four slot, Flanja. Again, these are not the order of the trailers we're going to play because um, we won't tell you who's doing them when voting. All right, uh, and the last one for group one. Legion, Natalia. Mm. Are you out there, Natalia? So that is group one. And we don't have to pick group two because everyone else is in group two. How's that sound? Does that make sense, right? Yes. Do we still have to pick group two? No, we don't. Okay. Should we get right into it? Yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, um, with no specific order, um, let me go back to this, and then let me um, do this. Okay, and um, let me then do what? one of these. What? What? No, I'm talking to them okay. while you're doing stuff. That was all I was gonna do. All right, who did we have here? Okay. Oops, sorry, keep hitting the mic, fellas. Trata. Trata tela. Trata. Welcome to hell. So just, just to remind you, we're gonna watch all the trailers. Wheel. And then we will um, uh, put them all up and you're voting for five. So we're going to vote on all the five and the top two scores leave. Okay. And then the lowest score out of everybody goes. So do you want to make notes on the, on the points too? Is yeah. that too much? All right. Um, all right. Our first trailer. 
You all right? I'm no, I'm not. I'm tickling I'm him. getting tickled. Okay. Sorry. Kitty wasn't reacting, though. You guys ready? Yes. Yeah. When Wilby Daniels became a part-time canine in The Shaggy Dog, he didn't realize that his condition would come back and hound him in his adult years. In this side-splitting sequel, Wilby's all grown up, but unfortunately he is still subject to a furry transition every time the inscription on an ancient scarab ring is read aloud. The Shaggy D.A. It's Walt the Disney Productions' like shaggiest comedy ever. The Shaggy D.A. Dean Jones is the underdog. Tim Conway. Elwood. Uh -uh. I am not Elwood. I am actually Wilby Daniel. Sure, gotcha. Suzanne Plachette. Whoop. Keenan Wynn. Grab <laughs> 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 that dog. Oh. <laughs> the crooks are out to get Wilby. Grab <laughs> that dog. And Wilby's out to bury your funny bone. Is he Wilby? It's the cleanest campaign in history. Oh, it's a cruise, oh, my boy. It's a slammer. Ending in a landslide of laughter. Walt Disney Productions, The Shaggy DA. Sing it again, Sam. The Shaggy DA. Soon in a kennel near you. Woof. Woof. <laughs> Holy shit. I've seen that movie. Have you really? I think so, yeah. I know that. I just know that I know that movie. That's crazy to me that that's a movie that exists. And I think it might have like played on Disney Channel or something when we were stealing cable from our neighbors. John! John! Jonathan! He can, he'll hear us in 30 seconds. Oh, he's watching. Hey. He's watching, yeah. John. John, I know you have experience as a PA. Can you bring me two of these? <gasps> you piece of <laughs> shit. I'll know. I'll get you. it for you. That's our cousin, John. Oh, you garbage he can. Motherfucker. <laughs> he's not wrong. Did you hear him say that? <laughs> yeah. I'm not wrong. He does have experience as a PA. I mean, but like, that doesn't mean you're John, not wrong for doing it. That I can live with. <laughs> they're going to be transparent. Thank you, my friend. Oh, are they? Well, they're green, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's sick. Ooh. Ooh. That's our cousin. <laughs> um, okay. Look, that was a strong first movie. All right. Um, I, I don't know what to say about that, but I was, like, impressed. That was so good. Yeah. That, that was, was so um, good. Okay. So, wow. Whoever's up. Group one. Is this group death? No. What? You know? When the really hard groups, what they call those group deaths? In the oh, the group things. of death, maybe. Of death. Okay. Um, okay. Let me see who else is in this group here. Um, sorry, everyone. I don't know what your real names are, but you emailed me with real names, and now I am figuring that out now. Okay. Okay. All right. Where are we, what are we looking Kobe. at? Kobe! Alright, you guys ready for the next one? Are you ready for the next one? I yeah. am. Alright. Once upon a time, there was an ordinary man and woman who couldn't have a baby, so they had to invent one. It was a most unusual baby.
like, holy shit, what the hell is that? That looked crazy. That was weird. That was wild. That was a wild one. <laughs> That's like one of those crazy things that like you'd only see like in a, a, a foreign movie, you know, where it was like, you never see like partial claymation animation stuff, right? Yeah. Man, that, is that French, you think? Or like some kind of Eastern European? I looked like Eastern European to me. Mm. Like. I love how Eastern European is such a vague, like... Either, either <laughs> Eastern or Northern. What's what's yeah. it called again? Otic? Otic? Yeah. Little Otic? I don't know that name. Little Otic. Polish, maybe? Maybe. Nordic? Oh, that looked cool. Nordic. Um, I love the early round, because people come out strong. I got, I, got yeah. a, I got a question. Sure. Who's in this round again? Can I get a refresher on who's um, in this round? Let me see. Who is in this round? It is Flanja, Niamix... Kit Black, Zombie Bender, Legion Italia. And while you type those in, I will be looking for a, another trailer. Okay. Um, again, let me just check. Could you guys hear us over the trailer or is it too fucking loud? I guess not Not that we're really saying like a lot of important stuff and we're pretty like gobsmacked about like the trailers themselves anyway. Uh, so far, we haven't had any stickers. Cannot hear me. Okay, Sleeve McDickle says no. Other people say sounded fine. So, wow. Sleeve Dick McDickles, get the wax out of your ears. I was enraptured, yes. Okay. Are you ready for the next one? Uh, yeah. Okay. Here we have Corporal Neil Corey, top marksman rating. Private Larry Garino. Alfred Bray, dubbed Papa Doc. Sonny Peel, martial arts expert. His friends call him Blood. Quang, forward scout and point taker. And this is our coordinator, Major Murphy Black. Enemy sighted, moving target, three seed. On target, on target, on target, fire, Why is she chasing a horse? Let's get ready for a clean kill. We're gonna start settling some accounts here. Major, this belonged to Lieutenant Woodring. Remember him? My cousin's got a silver outfit. Yeah, not all robots are dead. But all, all dog robots are boys. Keep still. This is fucking hard, dude. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Are we watching the movie? <laughs> 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 I like how the robot like malfunctions by fucking Wait, is that the end of the movie? I guess so. <laughs> did he but did he chop the snake or not? No, that's the beginning of the movie. Where right, this is the robot's ready. I love how Robo War is like two trailers. <laughs> <laughs> that, was that was great. Good. Jeez. Strong competition. These are all like trailer boys move trailers, you know? Yeah. Um, these I'm are all, these are all like trailer of the week, any week that they would be on the show. And that's, that's why the that tournament's so good. We'll see. Maybe it gets really tired after a while. Maybe yeah. like second round it's just gonna be people submitting half baked. True. What's your? What do you have against Half Baked? No, it's just we got a lot of people submitting Half Baked, and it's like everyone's seen Half Baked. 
True, 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 true. Okay. Do, do, do. This is the funniest part is like finding everyone's real name and being like, who are you? Who is this Legion Natalia at Gmail? Uh, the tra the uh, trailer volume seems a bit loud, and we seem a bit low per the year mix. Um, okay. And I believe I yeah. and it's a hey, it's a highlighted message. Look who it's from. I buy it. I'll just turn this up a little bit there. Turn us up a little bit. Uh, maybe that works. Maybe it doesn't work. Let me do this thing too. See that be like boop 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 boop. <clears throat> All right. Um, are you ready for the next one? Let me just say Robo War. That's uh, that was good. That feels foreign. I would rabbit hole that, but you know I don't want to derail the group stage here. So we're going through beautiful stuff. Um, let me see. Okay, you ready for the next one, y'all? Yeah. yeah. Chat, you ready for the next one? I guess not. Well, I'm ready, so fuck you guys. Ooh. All around the world, I like the girl. I like girls. I like girls. Is that cool? This song is good. I like girls. Is that the guy from Murderer. Murder. Oh, I thought it said murderer. Oh, Rumble in the Bronx. Good. Oh. Why is it so small? Like in the thing. I'm sorry, guys. Chef America, sorry. Now that's the real deal, baby. <laughs> I love girl. Tony Church, right? Right, yeah. I thought that was that had some cool stuff in it. Yo, I have to see this movie now. That yeah. looked fucking cool. That was cool. That like indie car. It wasn't an indie car, but it was an like open wheel car. How can you tell the difference between indie and like Formula it, One? It looks small. Is Formula One smaller than indie? Uh, I think indie cars are much bigger. Huh. Yeah. That looked cool as hell. Um, I would watch the shit out of that, man. No. I'm just seeing if I was right about that. If I, yeah, I, I would, I would watch that. That looked cool. That looked like like an ice road kind of thing. Uh, I think some people in again, if you guys are watching this, there is on the official whitest kids you know Discord, which you can see in the about section somewhere around here. Um, there is a now a Trailer Boys channel, which is great because a uh, lot of good conversation in there. Um, and a lot of good uh, movie talk. And I think a few people watched, excuse me, with your tired yawningness. We're in this. I'm just kidding. I'm having so much fun. We watched um, uh, Ice Sword Truckers the other night, and a few people in the chat said they saw it and they liked it. So, or no, wait, I don't think they liked I, it, but I did. <laughs> I liked it, but I didn't finish it. 
Okay. I fell asleep. It was funny because Nate was like, "We're going to bed. I'm going to bed," I'm and so then tired. we turned on Ice Road. At the yeah. And he like stayed up longer than the whole everyone. time. It was yeah. so good that I had to watch it. Okay, guys. Wait. Yep. All right. This is the last trailer of round one. So then we do the votes for round one, right? Yeah. yeah. You guys ready for the last trailer round one? And then we're voting after this. So remember all these trailers. <laughs> oh, this is cool. I've seen Goblin um, in live and they play like this. What does Lomora mean? Is that Italian? Limora! I think Lomora is Italian for we cheated at the Euro Cup. <laughs> the British are so ever bitter. Ever bitter. Europe's white trash. This is fucking cool. Can you? What? <laughs> She's in a trance. Yeah. It's definitely the most like musical in the trailer. What about we just watched? Uh, <laughs> cut back to them spinning again. <laughs> I just like the music yeah. so much. I mean, much. the way it's edited, where it's like, goes to that song, and it's like... Yeah. It's great. If you've ever seen Goblin live, this is a lot like what Goblin is like. And they're old as shit now. This was on Turner Classic Movies a couple of years ago. Thanks for the sub, Captain. Yeah, it's from it's from The Exorcist. Uh, maybe it's a little twisted to be different. Well, that's what it sounds like. I mean, like. there's no bass line in The Exorcist. Oh. This is this is crazy. And now there's vampires. It's got everything. It can't decide what song to use. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Damn. I feel like, you know, somebody was asking, like, what kind of trailers we watch when we watch Trailer Boys. And they're like, uh, it was John. And he was like, do you watch a lot of campy, weird trailers? And uh, it was like, yeah, we do watch a lot of campy, weird trailers. But every now and then we get, like, just really cool trailers, too. And that was fucking cool. That was a cool trailer. Yeah, that was. It started with someone lighting someone on fire. That was the beginning <laughs> of that trailer. Oh, that's so fucking tight. All right. Um, so, we're gonna go through that real quick one more time. Um, uh, oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna do the poll. Okay. Round one. So what you want to do here is you just want to vote for your favorite one, and the top two go on. And everybody else moves on to another one, except one, the lowest person in both, unfortunately. We had to even it out, you know? So, all right. So, Lamora, Lamora, which is the one we just saw, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that was um, like, a, like an Italian horror movie one, right? Yeah. And then there was China Strike Force. Yeah. Uh, I got a vote. Uh, what was the name of so Strike Force? Uh, hold on, I can't forget the name of half of these guys. I'm sorry. Uh, Robo War. Robo War. It's such a long road. Um, uh, little Otic. All right. Oh yeah, Little Otic, and then. Uh, um, 
That uh, shaggy the, DA. Shaggy DA. Shaggy DA. <laughs> was it the Shaggy DA? That shit was so crazy. <laughs> We're definitely going to watch that on a follow-up episode. Uh, shaggy. We're definitely going to watch that, like, while I'm home. I feel it's a movie that, like, you would definitely be like, man, I wish I still did drugs. It feels really familiar. Like, upsettingly <laughs> familiar. And now I'm wondering if my fascination with dog movies started there. Okay, everybody. So, um, the poll is live now. Um, and I want to say we always have, um, you know, a couple hundred people watching. I assume we have like 6,000 people watching. I don't know if that's right. Oh but shit. It's five. We never get five. What? People watching. Tonight. Oh, it's five people watching. So, I, you know, that means probably one person's going to vote. Yeah. But uh, we never get as many voters as we have watchers. I don't know why. So if you watch the show and you're not sure how to vote, if you pull up chat and you look at the very top over here or whatever, it'll say, like, current poll. All right, while, we're, while this is coming in, who is in Group B? Group B. Okay. Group B is everyone else. Yeah, yeah. You want me to name their names? Uh, I can remember three of them right. right now. Group B coming up next is Panwall. Professor Marthus Livicus. Schwingles. Okay. And the wizard herself, Christina Marie. I think she missed the whole thing when you're talking about the wizard too, which is really funny. Because <laughs> maybe she's not even understanding like however you're saying this. And Avalanche Fan 84. Um, cool. So, um, Schwingles and Christina Marie came in late. So, you guys should email me if you haven't already. Um, I know somebody we were having email issues with. You can just send me the message. It's not oh. the meme aspect of it, Chaos, while they're distracted by a door opening. Yeah, someone's about to interrupt the stream. Uh... It's not that I'm not familiar with memes. I'm very offline. It's the name and then several scenes. I don't know what you're talking about. We're still talking about Shaggy DA. Shaggy DA is so cool. We're still talking about Shaggy. And I'm like, I know I saw that when I was a kid. Okay, round one. Here it goes. Ooh, we have a point tie here. Oh, we got to write pick. these down because we're gonna um, we're gonna lose these. Do you want to write them down? Okay. All right, I'm down. All right, I'm down. All right. My handwriting is awful. Robot. They can't see it. Were you talking to me? Well, we could have John pick him. The, the Looks good. our PA. Well, we should pick because the it's our show, PA. right? The PA tie. It's I think called the let's, P, let's it's called the a, PA tie. It's called a PA tie. Hey, John, PA. I think we should do it at the end, though, right? Because it won't—it doesn't matter. <laughs> hey, what's up? <laughs> all right. Uh, have you been watching all the trailers? Uh, yeah, I think I caught all of them. Uh, we may—we may need there, you to there break a tie. There have been five so far. Uh, I do have two favorites for sure. Oh, good. Yeah. What are your I favorites? Right well, did you vote already? No, I didn't. See, vote. he didn't vote, so he—he he <laughs> should get to choose which. You guys yeah. fire him. <laughs> but um, <laughs> we'll choose at the end. No, no, we'll choose now. To find the round results. John say We have the round results. John but say here's here's progress. all I'm saying. Here's all I'm saying. Just hear say me out. Hear me out. Interest. All right, you please. Can, no, please. no, it's fine. Let's do whatever no, no. the fuck all you want to do because it's pointless. Okay, okay. All, okay. all I'm saying is, if he chooses one right now, and there's somebody that gets a lower point, so one person goes on, the next round, if somebody gets less points, that makes this decision worthless. The what? We're doing it by points. The person who gets the low, lowest points in the both rounds doesn't move on. But what about no, the no, decision? No, no, we're talking about <laughs> who goes on, who the winners are of this group. Oh, I thought you were talking winners. about the... Okay, shit, sorry. No, yeah. Uh, I thought you were talking about the bottom two, because right, so that was a tie as well. Did you see the, the, the trailers Little Odic? Uh, no, I don't remember. Which one was that? 
I don't think I saw that one actually. Damn it! Ah! I'm sorry. I really. All right. Yeah. It was the the like kind of Eastern European one with all the animation. Oh yeah, about the weird baby. Yeah, about the weird baby. You right, did so see it. Did see yeah, it. Yeah, you yeah, did yeah. see it. Okay, and did you see Robo Wars? Yeah, for sure. Okay, which one of those would you pick? Uh. Probably Robo Wars. Oh, Robo Wars. John! Sorry. What? It's okay. I didn't really have an opinion about it. This worked. I just this, felt like someone should be upset. Works, guys. Yeah. The system works. Okay. So Robo Wars goes on. Okay. So let me explain. Is there any way to write down who this is in the bracket here? Nick, give me your empty. Just, just let me know. <laughs> So, A1. It's a wild show tonight. Can you give me a, a soda water? Yeah. Please, thank you. I just need a back rub whenever you get a chance. <laughs> okay, Sam, it's you ready? All right, guys. so let's go through this. Um, the winner, who, what was the winner? Uh, Shaggy DA. Shaggy DA. All right. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I'm going through this real quick. Uh, Shaggy DA was Kit Black. Kit Black. Kit Black. Oh, Moving on to the next one. Kit Black is mega officially points, A1. Baby, mega okay, point. so Kit Black, you're moving on to the next round. And the tiebreaker went to Robo War. Is that correct? Yeah. Legion Italia moving Legion on to Italia. the next round. Legion Italia. Who lost out there? Who okay, just so the people it? that are going to move on to the next round, starting at the top, um, Little Otic was submitted by Zombie Bender. So you almost had it, bud. So Zombie Bender will get another chance. Um, China Strike Force was submitted by, I'm not going to say a real name, Flanja. I liked it. I'm surprised China Strike Force did not do as well. And Lamora was submitted by Neomix. So which one was the last place one? Uh, well, it was a tie. Uh, oh. Uh, between uh, China Strike Force and Lamora. Okay. And those were, it's Neomix. Those were my favorites. This is Sam's the switch you wanted. This is a tonic water. God damn it, John! You have so much. I'm going to go look. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sir. Uh, Bring the receipt, John. Wait, who is, who is China Strike Force? Zombie Vendor? Uh, that or was. Flanger. Let me see. Sorry. Sorry, guys. I, I just don't want to say your real names out loud. Um, China Strike Force was Flanja. Flanja. Damn. By the end of this show. I'm going to hire John as a producer on my show and take him away from you guys. We'll see how he does at the end of the show. Take him away I'll from you guys. That. Oh, dang. That's kind of weird. It's I'm open. Gonna, it's half It's half not like a drunk. personal drink. It's weird. Is that your personal soda water? It's kind of yellow. <laughs> it's kind of yellow. <laughs> already pissing he just out. gave you his own beverage for you to drink. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, Wait, well, COVID's a thing. Can I have gross. Sick. Um, Thanks, John. We better be tipping, John. Um, Here's uh, a tip. Yeah, don't work with these guys. Get better representation. Here's a tip. Take oh, your sorry. shirt off. He's uh, John's a shit. Oh, uh, come he lives on. in Austin and he works in the television business. Okay. Um, do we have anything to do before we move in right into round two? No. Okay. We're going right into round two. This everybody. is wild. Is it wild? It just feels really wild. Okay. I'll let you slide one of these things randomly to me because I was just kind of picking them and I kept picking the same name over and over again. So. Can you hit me with that? Yes. Okay. Oh, you know why? Um, it was done on an envelope, and some of the pieces are sticking together because of the glue. Pull them apart. So they weren't mixing up. Um, here's a tip: sell feet picks. That's a good one. That's a good one. Thick and wing. Okay. Yes. Here we go. Second wing. It's a little cousin. Recommend recommending some feet one? picks. That's Nate's gig. Yes, I'm ready. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. There's enough room in the feet pick business. Aww. I will 
destroy you with my turbo glove, the ultimate weapon against the robot threat. But to be a true hero, you have to save your girlfriend. Hey, what's that in your hand? It's a, it's a comic book. <laughs> what's it about? It's about a turbo rider. That's rad. I always wonder what the other side looked like. It's kind of gray and dusty. Well, I could show you. Around here, we like to do things with a little more joie de vivre. Where is she? <laughs> that's <laughs> that's joie de vivre. As you may know, the situation is critical. We have reached maximum. This looks like Waterworld. Remember that part of Waterworld? Who exactly are you supposed to be? This is it, soldier. We have to hit these sand machines with everything we've got. Find them. Kill them. Back is there one of the Jonas brothers? I'm meeting up with an old mate. Straight yeah, that's Zeus. John Jones. Ah, what do you say? Let's roll. One row? Faith of our future. I always think everybody's my car. She could have been more like the real Turbo Rider. But she could totally be Turbo Kid. <laughs> Too boring. Nothing happens. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was cool. I like, we've talked about this before, like movies that kind of, uh, they're like new movies, but they're made to look old movies. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Do you not like that? I'm not a fan. I think it's cool. Because also it's like, um, uh, you know, you can see how like people can make a movie now. Like we see a lot of movies in in Trailer Boys where it's like somebody went and made a we movie. We see a and lot you're of like, movies. It looks bad, but like that looked like a real movie. Yeah, that <laughs> looked like a real movie. That was cool. Good for that. I've they heard of it before. You've heard of uh, Turbo Kid? Yeah, I've not seen it. It looks like um like a draft house thing, you know? Yeah, yeah. I would watch a shit out of that. I liked it. We have another name. You got it. Well, I, I, the one who picks it, it doesn't matter if you see it right away. Oh, no. Don't run over my hand. I just don't want it to be... Um, Look at this well-oiled machine. Right. Okay. Okay. Um, wait, who submitted the second place? What was the second place movie? It wasn't Shaggy D.A.? It was Robo Wars. Who submitted Robo Wars? Was it Legion Legion Talia? I don't know. I already said it out loud. I hey guys, who submitted out. Robo Wars? <laughs> Somebody out there will know. Uh, I'm doing too many things. Who submitted Robo Wars, guys? Come on, the show can't go on until we find out. All right. Uh, a a yeah, there it is. Legion Talia Robo War. Cool. Robo War. Robo War. Sorry. Okay. All right. Cool. <laughs> Uh, you can hold on to that. Okay. We have one trailer down from group two. There goes Group Legion. B? Is it group B? Group two. Group B. Group B. All right. Next trailer. Group B's newer movies. You know that evil heavy metal that your parents hate you listening to? <laughs> Those lyrics about hell, demons, What if I told you it's all real? I know. I was there. Jesus! It's piss. That's me, Brody. My friends are losers. So we started a band. Check it out. Ricky Daggers. Can you see that? TV? No. I mean, I might be. Um, I did that. I did that. I'm sorry, Green Gogo. Okay. We're gonna die. I 
translated those pages. But now, people are turning crazy. Like, possessed. Crazy. What's up? That was pretty cool. As is, I mean, the axe and the... <laughs> I'm not even sure I'm in the right tuning. Brother Steel. I love that. That uh, had like some uh, Army of Darkness kind of vibe to the end there. Yeah. I like that. What, what, what country was that? New Zealand? I thought it was Australian. Is it New Zealand? Australian? Um, I saw people in chat saying we've already seen it. Technically, here's the thing. We watched it uh in between a round of voting i i don't i think we watched it um uh, on a round where it wasn't in the theme and watched a different trailer so that one still counts but when we did watch it the first time it was a different trailer and it wasn't in contention for voting so that one that should be considered guys okay um yeah i like that I liked, um, again, that's another one that's like, I guess it's not made to look old, but it's like a newer movie that's not a yeah. well-known movie, and I thought that was cool. Group B's new stuff. But I, I like also, um, I, I like the Army of Army of Darkness, Evil Dead kind of vibe to it. I would say more Army of Darkness than Evil Dead, but I do like that kind of like, there's like some goofiness to it. I don't like that. Movies. I don't like you looking at me in the eyes at first looking straight. Do this, you want me to look is, at your eyes through there? Yeah, this is okay. how we do trailer boys. It's looking straight. Don't look at me in the eye. This. Ugh. If I look straight, though, this is my direction. Yeah, you got to look that way. Okay. You're not allowed to look at the screen anyway. Why are you looking at the screen? Why can't you just look at me in the face? It's our religion. Just look here. It's our religion. Connect with not... me as a brother. No, no, gross. <sighs> gross. Um, that makes me think you guys have intimacy issues. Who, us? Yeah. We just always... Can we tongue kiss on... No. It's TOS. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Can we kiss kiss? Everyone is dying in chat. They're gross. Everyone is like throwing up. No, they love computers. it. They're like, keep going, please. I'm about to cream. Yeah, and they're all like, man, I wish they would start getting all Mom! Crazy. Mom, Sam's being dirty. He used to do this when we were kids, just too. screaming. When I was like with a woman, he'd be like, Mom! No, <laughs> you'd be like in the mud. Yeah, when, when I was with a full-grown woman. All right, let's move on to the third trailer. Are you ready? Uh, yes. Ooh. When the time comes, you will know the day the music dies and the new wave crashes and the glass shattered. What the fuck is this? And make them hurt. Trying to turn it up, guys. Sorry. Beginning in the dingy back streets of London, Kate and Danny are trying to get a band together. One, two, three, four. And finding trouble everywhere. <laughs> is that Cortana? Trouble with the law. Some of us. Trouble in the clubs. And the growing violence, which is London in the 80s. Soon, she knows she's going to hit the big time. She's picked up, plugged, and pushed around by the promoters. And still Just the hair of like a Lego person. I hate that one here. 
Boston film. She's half in love with Danny. Skinheads. Half wishing it had never started. And she's finding that the big time is a pretty empty place. Phil Daniels. She wrote the shallows. Finch star <laughs> in Breaking Glass. Introducing Hazel O'Connor as Kate. Featuring Hazel's own words and music. This let me know what done. There's not the world. Featuring her own words. Yeah. She did all the words. Her voice. Yeah. Her I did all the words. Some people call them lyrics, but they're really Breaking just words. Glass. Live it's the experience oh my God, this is shattering. Should yeah. It. Yeah. Why can't we close these things, man? Why can't we close these things? No, it's it's the how they some whoever set up the video on YouTube. Damn it! Put the cards too early. That's why you got to cut it, cut down those cards at the end of your video. I think I put some cards at the. You know, gotta make sure they're short enough. I don't know how to do that. Elephant. Figure it Elephant, out. Elephant, if you're watching. Figure it out. I fucked up some shit. Um, that was cool, man. Have you ever heard of that? No. I've not heard of that either. No, it looked cool. I liked, um, I liked the style of it. What is that? Um, this bottle? It was John. I'm going to watch that. Hi, Mom. Hi. What was that, um, that Lady Gaga thing? Star is Born. Star is Born. It, it, I wonder if it's like a low-key nod at Star is Born, you know? It's like another rendition. Another version of it. A fifth version of it. Uh. Um, that was cool. That was cool, I gotta say. Get some interesting stuff in, round, in, in Group B. Okay, hand me another name. That was good. I liked it. It's Kathy with a K. Who's asking? They're not asking. They just put both options. Yeah. This person seems totally fine. Their name is Sith, Sith Psychopath. Yeah. They seem oh, safe. Oh, wait a second. Psychopaths are bad. <laughs> not necessarily. Yeah, look at you walk back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys ready for the next one? Guys, don't say what what once he did. All five of these are mine. Oh, full moon! Seems a little problematic to me. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> what the fuck? You're already, yeah. you're already, <sighs> you know, kind of uh, uh, exploiting these people. Uh, <laughs> oh man, that's crazy. I I fucking love Full Moon though. Like that's that's that was that was crazy because the premise <laughs> of the movie started out. And it was like, this guy has a machine that makes these book characters come to life. Yeah. And, and he's uh, uh, 
he's making them come to life and and he also he chooses to to bring all the monsters to life oh no do you guys want to know something that i thought though i thought he meant to make them this big <laughs> and that's size, what it is uh, by the wrong size i thought they were saying he made them too big and i was like now yeah i can see how that would be a problem you expected them just to be this small i can handle this frankenstein you know what i mean <laughs> but like if it gets bigger huh? Sleeve McDickle says genetically inferior monsters. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been a probably uh, Forget, very problematic. Man. I'm going to write a hoo ha ha <laughs> article that's going to get this movie canceled. Travis Taylor says at least it wasn't called Hard R Monsters. Right. Which is true. <laughs> <laughs> that that's is insane. Crazy. Dude. That's crazy. Oh, uh, I, I, that's, that's kind of blowing my mind how funny that is. Like in such a like a uh, what the fuck is going on kind of way, you know? Same. I was like, they're too big. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. That is, I, oh man. Because I, I think it's funny too, because that's one of like the newer Full Moon movies too. You know, it's like the um, no, Evil it's from Bong. 1997. Oh, really? Huh. I mean, according to the video yeah, right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. We guess they've been doing videos for a while. That's like right in the middle. I don't know what this one is, but I'm interested in seeing this. Oh, why are you interested in seeing that one? Um, the car in the back that looks like <laughs> a uh, Toyota, a Ford Taurus, right? She's wearing orange gloves. Orange, my favorite color. Um, that was silly. <laughs> you know, I have the last That's name. A word. Yeah, that was <laughs> silly. <laughs> Oh, what I'm a saying si- silly a lot lately. That what a was silly. silly movie. That was silly. Okay. What a silly title. They should have called that Silly Monsters. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> that was so weird, though. Oh, I, like imagine the pitch to that, though. Being like, yeah. all right, here's the thing. This guy's a machine that can make like the literary classic monsters come to life. And they're like, okay, I don't yeah. get it. What's the? And they're like, but. <laughs> well, no, but that's the thing. It's like, okay, all right, that sounds interesting. No, there's more. <laughs> yeah, this the working title for w- this was uh, "These Monsters, Poor Mothers." <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think we would get to the title, and I would be like, "This is the most offensive part of this." <laughs> oh, weird. Okay, all right. You ready for the last one of the round, everyone? I am. Okay. You're supposed to answer. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm worried about this one. Oh really? Oh, well, it's green. It's R. Okay. They spoke of it first in whispers, then it took the media by storm. Password. Scrooge. So be it. Scrooge. Is that the password? Scrooge. Bob Guccione and Penthouse Films International present Caligula. If only all Rome had just one neck. Yes. Is this the original story? It's now over! He's mad! No treachery could equal his evil. No evil was more treacherous. Creation of power gone mad in all its insane dimension. It's Caligula. So take my horse to his own bed. Chaos? The emperor who devoured Rome. <laughs> cruelty for cruelty, lust for lust. A film that tells the truth as no film ever dared. I hate them! Malcolm McDowell, Teresa Ann Savoy, Helen Mirren, Peter O'Toole, was Helen Mirren? John Gielgud, in the most controversial film ever made. Caligula, no rumor can match the reality. You've seen this? I saw some people in chat saying they've seen yeah. this. I've never seen it. Yeah, no. I used to own it, I think, on VHS. I'm pretty sure it's an adaptation of the Camus play, which, I mean, like, I think that's the thing, is that it's... Uh, Schwingles is saying there's no truth in...
<laughs> well, that was cool. <laughs> I don't know what else felt. I don't know, Mom. It was loud. Nah, it's just a laptop. No. Um, what were you saying? Can I do something to help? Uh, can you fix the laptop that's completely broken? I can give you a white claw, but... Is it Don't worry, guys. It wasn't his laptop. It's not completely broken. <laughs> it was my laptop. That's my mom's hand. Hey, does it come off of this? That's a mom... That's a yeah. mom wife. Hi, how are you? Uh, and yeah. you, and you. Oh, whoa. Anyway, oh, that's a look at that. What you don't see the crack? It's okay, it's okay. Um, okay, oh, so that was Caligula, uh, and that was better than I thought it would be. Um, I know Marth had submitted that previously, and I was hesitant to watch it because I wasn't sure like how it really fit with some of the themes we've been done. But that was a that was a cool trailer. The music was great. Um, oh, this is a screen protector. Yes. All right. Sorry. Okay, everyone, we are gonna start doing the um, voting. Sorry. Let's stay in it. Let's stay okay. in it. Okay. Uh, laptop, move on. Right. Physical things. Um, all right. Let me just check real quick. Boom. Okay. Oops. I made this one wrong. Let me just update the name of one of these things. All right. Just to recap, we had Deformed Monsters, Breaking Glass, which I accidentally called Shattered Glass, it's a different movie. What's Shattered Glass? It's uh, about Stephen Glass, a guy that wrote uh, at the New Republic. Uh, Start Hayden Christensen and um, uh, what's his name? Sars Peter Sarsgaard. Okay, let's recap for everybody what we've watched. Ready? <clears throat> Sam. Uh, okay. Okay. Group B. Group. Um, we watched Caligula. Caligula. We watched, what was that metal one? The heavy metal one? Deathgasm. Deathgasm. We watched Turbo Kid. Uh, Emily? Hmm. Breaking Glass. Breaking Glass. Do you remember anymore? Mm -mm. You don't remember? Are you upset? Mm -hmm. Why Did upset? I crack this? Mm -hmm. uh, and Deformed <laughs> deformed Monsters. Jesus Christ. Do you think that was the first title they went with for that? Uh, <clears throat> All right, I guess. bet it was like, <clears throat> It's called the four monsters or I walk. <laughs> All right. The poll is live now. You have two minutes. If you've never voted before, please look at your chat. Look at the top of the chat. It'll say current poll group B. And we're doing this for dose minutes. So what we're going to do now is we realize that, um, you know, I didn't write down who these people are, which is kind of a, uh, so Shaggy Dave is Kit Black. So Kit Black is on the next round. And then Rubble War was... I know you said it. Did you write it down? Uh, Rubble War was Legion Italia. All right. And then Little Otic. Uh, was that Zombie Bender? I don't know. I'll have to look it up. I know. I know. Uh, is it was either Zombie Bender or Flanja. I think it was Zombie Bender. Okay. okay. Group B, voting is up now. What are some good movies? <laughs> we don't watch good movies uh, here. Sucker to Sally. I don't know. The Godfather. Um, Ice Road Truckers, the movie. Uh, actually, I will say. Uh, 
we watched um what was that movie we watched freedom riders i didn't see it that movie ruled okay with mads mickelson riders of justice that's what it was I didn't see it. Can you tell us about it? Uh, Mads Mikkelsen and a bunch of, I think it's like Dutch people. Or it takes place in Estonia. Is he Dutch? Uh, I think so. Estonia. You get Estonia? Alright, so where are we at? Group B is over now, and the winners for Group Not B needed. are... What? Do you want to write this down? Really? Why? Because it cracked this? <laughs> yeah. it's, it's the screen protector. Hey, let's play the game that we're doing the stream for. Fuck the computer. <laughs> it's not about the computer, Nate. We're okay. trying to have a baby with this guy. He's going to kill my baby. <laughs> Look at Nate's face. Okay. And, and Nate's the winner <laughs> for the round is Deformed yeah, right. Monsters. Nate Second loves place is Caligula with 19 points. Third place is Turbo Kid with nine. And then we have Deathgasm and Breaking Glass with seven. Deathgasm and Breaking Glass with seven. But now I don't know. All right, so unfortunately... So I would say we have to pick between Deathgasm, Breaking Glass, and what were the other two? The other two got nine points, though. The other two, so these two both got seven points. What were the other two? The other two, the the bottom two in the other rounds were Lamore and China Strike Force. Oh yeah, and yeah. And then we have and Turbo, uh, no, not Turbo, uh, which Death Gasm and Breaking Glass. Lamore. Yeah. That was like the crazy Italian one with like the um, the, the Exorcist music. Oh it was yeah. Italian. Yeah. Somebody said it was French, so. Yeah. Lamore was cool. Um, I would think. I would think. Group A was a little stronger than Group B, so I'll, I'll narrow it down. Like I think that's right. That seven. Well, I think there's seven points. Do you want to vote off with the chat here? No, I say we vote between us. I think that way it's quicker. But then, if we have chat do it, then we're uh, not responsible for having to take somebody out. I think you got to be willing to be a bad guy to I'll, be a good guy. Okay. I'll take someone out. Okay. So all right, we're talking about. Who goes on in the next round? Is it Deathgasm or Breaking Glass? All right, I've got my vote. Which one was Breaking Glass? The one where it was like the London, like, kind of punk. Oh, yeah, that's of, mine. I that picked that. That was my pick, too. I'm going to have to go against you guys You're and say do that was also my pick. Are you going to oh. oh, I thought oh. you were going to use your triple so vote. So sorry and take to over. Deathgasm. All right, so what we have here... Sorry to Deathgasm. Who is Deathgasm? Deathgasm was... I don't want to say the wrong name. Hold on. Sorry, guys. Um... Uh... Avalanche Fan 1984. Avalanche Fan Sorry, 1984. Friend. Sorry. You're dead. Sorry, bud. It was good. It was good. It was a good run. But you know what? I think, you know, um, chat knows their shit. Like, chat was like, we saw this, I'm not voting for it, you know? So yeah. it's like, you know, Avalanche fans submitted it, and uh, it wasn't in the list, sure, but, you know, it uh, it wasn't what we counted. But, you know, if if you watch the show, maybe, may, I don't know, I don't Av know, maybe that would have gone. Avalanche fan, 1984, your 10th place, but that also means your 10th best. Huh. Yeah, you did. You were in, so we're good. That's right. what they should say to kids when they play sports. Um, so we'll go through. We'll go do. through the uh, top of the list. Best. So, so deformed monsters, Panwall going on to the next round gets the buy. Uh, second place with Caligula, Professor Marth live also next round, and so the one. remaining two that are competing for the third bracket are Turbo Kid submitted by Shringles. And Breaking Glass, submitted by Christina Marie. So, pretty interesting so far, guys. So now it's going to get a little faster. So now, let me bring up... Um, you haven't filled those out yet? Yeah. We did drop the laptop, so... Uh, let me... Uh, <laughs> So 
sorry. Hold on. Let me um, let me do this real quick. All right, I got it. Um, and let's see. So the Group A winners. The people need to know. Oh, Marth's got a street crew involved, huh? I see how it is. Uh, let me see. And this, I'll say this: don't tell people which one's yours. Yeah, yeah. Keep it low key, guys. Keep it low key. Uh... But so, if you look at the list here, the Group A winners were Kit Black and Legion Talia, I think, right? Yep. Yep. And then the Group B winners were Panwall and Christina Marie. Wait, no, not Christina Marie. I'm sorry. Marth. Professor Marth Live. And so you can interpret what's going on there. So now, everyone else that didn't win, that would be Christina Marie, Schwingles, um, Zombie Bender, Niamix, Flanja, hit me with another email uh, with your next round results. Um, and this is going to be another one where the five of you are going against each other, similar to this round. We're going through it, and then we're going to go into the head-to-heads right after that. So the sooner you do it, the better. We'll get right into that. Feel free to email me. Um, if you want to just hit me um, the next ones now. Yeah, sorry, guys. In chat. Oh, we're doing this now? Yeah, yeah, we're going. Drama! We're going through it. We're just going to push through. And Fucking drama! And I it just sent you... I hacked your email again, and I sent you the updated... No, no, that's not it. That's not it? It's in that email, but it's the second one. Yeah, that one. This one? Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop. You're calling it trailer? Boop, boop. Yeah, I don't That's know. bold. That's bold. All right. Uh, bracket. Sorry, guys. Properties. Browse. This one here? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Boom. And okay. And we're pushing that Spreadsheet live. boys. Boom. Pushing it live. There you go. You can see everybody right now. Um, why is Kit Black green? I was going to do colors and then uh, I I backed out of it. Okay. But not entirely. Who's legit versus Marth? Legion Italia. Okay. Leg it. Leg it. Yep. Okay. Legion. But wouldn't it be the winner? Nope. You're right. You're right. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Sorry. 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 My bad. Uh, All right. Well, we're going to go into the third round. Okay. You all feeling it now? Or no, not, not the third Second. group. The group Group C. Group C. Oh, group group C? C. Yeah, this yeah. is the loser group. Yeah, this is the loser group. Uh, but they still have a chance to win the whole thing. Yeah, right? they can yeah, win yeah, the whole yeah. thing. They're just a bunch of losers. All right. I mean, okay. It seems kind of harsh to me. I mean, but you're, you're kind of of that generation where everyone's a winner. You're part of the whole participation award. What was your generation like? My, we rub some dirt on it, you know? Okay. Rub some gold on it. <laughs> yeah, that's you. I wish. Okay, everyone. Golden band-aids. You ready? Yeah. We're watching? All right. Yeah. <coughs> oh, no. Shit, hold on. Hold on. Pause. Pause it. Pause it. Acty. Acty, pause it. <laughs> get it? It's a reference to the show that Sam was in. I don't get it. Well, phantasm. You've never seen the show. The delusion of a disordered mind. A phantom. A spirit. A ghost. 
For most of his life, a young man has been pursued by a sinister force. Now he must learn the secret of the ultimate evil. Now it is time for you to come back. Hey, Mark to me. <laughs> if this one doesn't scare you, you're already dead. Phantasm 3, coming soon. I like the voiceover of that. Yeah. That was cool. That, that was, was a dope. classic one. Um, oh. I saw that, right? Uh, you started watching that one. Yeah. We watched the first one, and then they skipped the second one. On. Oh wait, no, you left. I, I, I left, that. and you guys were watching it. And I was like, and it went to it went fan. This was on Pluto. You know, I'm brought to you by Pluto TV, and it went. They we had Phantasm one, Phantasm three, and Phantasm four. I fucking love Phantasm boy. Wait, did you say they they didn't have three? They didn't have two. Oh, why is that? I don't know. It's too bad. No, two rules. I fucking love two. I, I don't think I've ever seen a Phantasm movie. Really? Yeah. Oh, they're awesome. Yeah, they are so fun. In. That is like... Phantasm 2 is one of my favorites. Okay, we're going to the next one. You guys ready for this? Boy. Who's buried in Midian? Ain't nothing but dead folk. Somewhere. <laughs> hidden from sight. <laughs> closer than you might think. <laughs> is a place that's not on any map. Midian. Something's reading there. It looks a lot like hell. <laughs> but they call it home. There goes the neighborhood. They're He's wearing a leather jacket. You know, what the fuck? They're not are neighborly. Y'all come back now. You hear? They're not even human. But this time, they're the good guys. From the imagination of Clive Barker comes Nightbreed. You can't go down there. They have only one enemy. A beast called man. Sworn to destroy the night breed. Sounds like we're going head to head with the devil himself. And only one chance. A man. Moon! Called Moon. It's time to fight! Go get him, boys! I'll kill you! What chance have we got? They're armed. So am I. Out of your deepest fears and your darkest fantasies, Clive Barker brings you a startling new breed of adventure. I won't let you down. Nightbreed. At last, the night has a hero. Outstanding. Cool. Cool. That was cool. That was a cool one. I like the use of that song. What is, what is that? That's from uh, Aliens. That was cool. Have you seen Nightbreed? Uh, music track is from Aliens. Resident Evil's got my back. Um, I've never seen Nightbreed. I've never seen Nightbreed. Nightbreed has a fucking awesome movie cover. Like, the cover of the VHS is so fucking cool looking. Because it's, like, all neon green. And, uh... Look up the Nightbreed... Like, like look look up Nightbreed poster. See if you can... I'm not really set up for that. Let me just see. If it, look at it and, and go, ooh! That, the one with the green Nightbreed there. 
This one? Or no, like no, no. One? The Yeah, that that one. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Raza Snowshe. Mm, not for me. No? You don't like the poster? The poster's cool as shit. The poster's... If you guys saw what we were seeing, right. you'd be like, that's cool. Um, it's all right. It's just, they lost me at a... Uh, they said something about, like... I don't know. You always like the bad guys to be the bad guys? No, nah, just when it was like, and the only thing is a man. And I'm like, oh, get me out of here. <laughs> the only You're thing like, that can I don't want a man. I'd rather the world turn to hell than yes, a man Yes, a thousand save us. percent. Well, they're trying to save the, the monster. If goals. there's a fire and I'm asleep, don't take me out. Neither one of you send a woman in there to get me. Okay, Erica Badu. You'll drop me. <laughs> All right, next one. You guys ready? Yeah. I wonder, I wonder what, what movie the it is. The trailer trailer. <laughs> Thanks for warning us. Tom Hanks wanted was a quiet vacation at home. This, this is what quiet. I need, Carol. I, I need yeah. this. Welcome to Mayfield Place. A typical street in the burbs. Morning, Walter! Where nothing much ever happened. Walter's dog just took a dump on Rumsfield's lawn again. Until the Clopex moved in. Clopex? Clopex. Clopex. No one goes in, no one comes out. Neighbors from hell. It was a nice place to live. He said he thinks the Clopex are evil incarnate. Well, you're much too smart to fall for that, aren't you, honey? But now... Carol! You wouldn't want to visit there. Ray, this is Walter. No! <laughs> the Burbs. I'm going over the fence, and I'm not coming back till I find a dead body. Ray, do you want him to take your family, kidnap them, tear their livers out, and make some kind of satanic pate? <laughs> We got a real problem. I hit the gas line, I'd run! God, I love this street. Tom Hanks. I think we are overreacting. No. The Burbs. It's one hell of a neighborhood. Hey, honey. I think we should move. I don't remember that. I, I mean, I, I know I watched that movie as a little kid, and it's I, I know it scared me. I know it was like a scary movie, and I, and I know it ended up being like a cult classic that everyone loved. I saw it on Comedy Central. Oh, really? I like that movie. Was it funny? Yeah, it was fine. It's interesting. It's kind of a take on uh, Rear Window. Uh, I feel like the scariest part of that movie is the dream sequence. That was the part that always scared me. I remember that. For some reason in my head, there's a part with a trunk. Is there a part with a trunk? I feel he like opened the they... trunk and something scared me in there. I, I was a little kid. I don't know. We watched a lot of like scary movies that we shouldn't be watching as little kids. Yeah, that's, I think it was that's five the eighties for when, you. When our aunt Jen showed us, showed showed me Poltergeist, and I wasn't a big fan of that movie. Well, that's PG. Is Poltergeist PG? Mm -hmm. That scared the piss out of me, dude. Yeah. Um, all right. So, you, how are you feeling, the Burbs? The Burbs. Uh, I liked it. I, you know, the hard thing is like sometimes when you see stuff as an adult that you have like some kind of, you know, if you asked me about the Burbs before seeing this, I'd have been like, oh yeah, I think that scared me as a little kid. But um, seeing it now, like out of context, I think is interesting because it's like now I'm like now I have to watch that and see what the hell that yeah. movie is all about, you know, as an adult. Um, Did we watch The Shining when we were kids? I probably. I feel like I've always seen The Shining. I. Are you okay? No, I mean, no, like, that's babe, like... you shouldn't always be seeing The Shining. <laughs> yeah, I always <laughs> see The Shining. It's like, I don't remember a time before having seen The Shining. I don't remember my first time seeing The Shining. I saw Poltergeist when I was really little, too. Because people will go, Carol Ann, to me, because I look like the little kid. Still gives me, like... Sorry. We, we used to rent a movie theater out, and... I was like, we'll play cool movies. And like the first one, we would do it like, uh, I think I've mentioned this before, but we would rent, there was any movie theater. It wasn't like, you know, an AMC thing. And they had a smaller theater and they called it like the screening room, but it was just, it was an actual movie theater sized thing, but it was just smaller. And so they let us, we rented it out like every two weeks and just play a movie for our friends. And anyone could come. It was like a public thing uh, and it was free. 
And the first time we watched Three O'Clock High, which is the shit, if you guys have not seen, uh, and then the two other friends that were splitting the cost of the theater with me were just super into horror. So, like, the first one we watched after that was Poltergeist, and I was so bummed out. I was like, me. Um, but Did you go? Yeah, I mean, I had to. I was, like, doing Did this stuff. Did you raise yourself? No, I was just like, it. you know what the funny thing is, like, after watching Poltergeist and stuff and seeing the end of it, you're like, oh, it's kind of like a Stephen Kingy like, you know, E.T., you know, kind of thing. It wasn't, like, actually scary, but still. I mean, that's the kind of the thing with, with horror movies. When you're a little kid, you don't watch them, and they tend to be... Uh, What's the one where the braces scary. take over? Um, Isn't that in one for, of the Nazis wearing... No. Uh, the braces, 40-year-old virgin. No. The braces gives them no, a there's, shot. isn't one of the poltergeists, one of the kids is in the bathroom and their braces start coming off their face and attacking them or something? Is that correct? Oh, that's crazy. That's a question for chat. Poltergeist 2 is what Hendo Calrissian says. Oh, well, you're right. All right, next one. Show Hi, Lydia. Factory! Oh, wait, no. This is the same one. <laughs> Game G. All Tom Hanks. Sorry, same one. P2. Poltergeist um, 2. That'd be funny if somebody submitted the same thing, the verbs. It was like, of all the movies, you submitted the same verbs movie twice. Okay. So is this trailer 3? Um, we're about to watch trailer 4. Oh, trailer our feature presentation. Wait, no, that's it. I got it. <laughs> Lloyd Kaufman. Lloyd Kaufman. Is that? Oh, I think that's uh, Lloyd Kaufman's promo. Yeah. Something horrible is invading New York. Something terrifying. Something you've never seen before. It's the killer condom, the rubber that rubs you out. The Danger is out. everywhere. The army of condoms have overrun the city. Only one man is brave enough to take on the crazed condom. Luigi Macaroni, police detective. He alone must do battle with the army of death, preying upon the citizens of New York City. Played by Udo Samuel, star of the masterpieces of German cinema, Far Away So Close, and Caspar Hauser, Macaroni must save the city and himself from the destructive power of the killer condoms. The conspiracy that he uncovers is so shocking that it could cost him his life. Under the direction of Martin Waltz and boasting the lavish production of Ralph Dietrich and Harold Rakevner, Ralph Koenig's comic book becomes terrifyingly real. Brought like to a horrifying life by Academy yeah, Award winner yeah. H.R. Sure. Geiger, whose creations thrilled you in Alien and Species. Killer Condom was an official selection of the prestigious yeah. Berlin Film Festival and has won accolades from audiences worldwide. US. In a world where safe sex is deadly, it's Men the killer condom, the rubber that rubs you out. out. It's from Troma, of course. It's from Troma, of course. It's from Troma. Do you think the condom kills the dudes or the women's? The dudes, for sure. Really? Oh yeah, bites their wees. You can see that. Never wear condoms. That's what I take away from this. Good Don't job. wear condoms. I was almost named Luigi Macaroni if I was going to be a boy. It's, it's true. Yeah. It's a traditional Italian name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I was going to be a boy. That was what they had picked out. Luigi Macaroni. So no wear, don't wear condoms. That's what this movie is saying. Good job, Nate. Yeah. Guys, buckle up and cover it up. Okay, now we're in the last... Um, the last of the losers. Hey, I like losers. to say group C. I like to I say like group to C. Say group well, C. Let's at least call them group D. D? For dunces. Why not group L? It's okay. I, it's, a, it's a compromise. You said C. I call them losers. All right. Group D. Group D, guys. Ready? Have you seen this? 
This is a cult classic. for this is, has always been cool like Thank no you. matter what po poster and stuff has been so that was house what is this behind your head here huh. here's the thing here's my thing with house house md or the house ha the movie house md okay um with that trailer it's a new trailer I wish we we saw the original trailer because I don't think that's the original trailer. That's the trailer for the DVD. When, what year did that come out? Somebody said late seventies or eighties. Eighty five. Yeah, for some reason when I watched it, it, it was so trippy that I thought it was more of like a seventies thing because it felt like seventies. So I was like, oh, eighty five. This is weird. But that's definitely a cult classic. I remember getting high in marijuana and watching it with a bunch of friends of mine because they were like, you have to see this movie while stoned. Okay. Putting the trailer up. Keep talking. Uh, was, was that, that wasn't supposed to be Mia Mix's trailer, right? Yeah, Foxy. Because uh, in chat she said that wasn't mine. You can get one. I can't do it. No, that was But not. you can get uh, one. Well, maybe it was. I don't know. Okay. I'm going to put this up for three minutes because I have to pee. All right. So we'll make talk. sure. Oh, my gosh. Oh, content does not meet guidelines. What did condom? I say that was bad? Condom? Can I not say condom? Yeah, because people have all these polls where they're like, hey, guys, should I wear a condom? Can you not say condom? You might not be able to say killer. Killer Connie. There we go. Yeah. Oh, oh. Killer Connie. Killer Connie means, means condom. Just so you know that. Killer Connie. No, Killer Connie is a different movie. You didn't see the trailer, dude. It's a mystery trailer. Uh, Killer Connie, that means condom. You guys, what's going on? Fuck, man. What's up? No, what not, not, that? not you. Not you. We're not talking to you. We're talking to each other. Why are we not talking to me? Because, Sam, you're sitting on the whole seat and then complaining about it. Did you see how much I was? Guys, we're sitting on this ottoman together. Hi, pan wall. And I was taking up a three by three inch corner of it well i mean let's look at the actual problem here we're sitting on an ottoman so nate can sit on a titan a secret labs titan chair that's mine do you guys like my new chair this show's not brought to you by titan so don't go buy a chair for this show but next time you're on my show i'll give you guys coupon code it, it gives you zero dollars off what trailer didn't we show Um, I'm going to stream oh, Adventress. Oh, yeah, makes his trailer. Wait, what? Yeah. Was there only four shown? Mm. Or what? How many? 
We watched Phantasm, Nightbreed, The Burbs, Killer Condom, and House. That's what I was trying to say. Earlier. Yeah. Hmm. Did I fuck something up, guys? You it's fine. It's a it's a okay. mess. Nymex knows what's up. We got it. I don't have another round. Oh, wait. oh. There, we got it. <laughs> <coughs> oh, weird. Yeah. On Tuesday, Who's, Adventress. What was somebody, that I, I must have showed somebody extra. Oh, this person made it to the next round. Oh, crap. I burned a trailer. Hold on, hold on. Well, all yeah, right, that's on. what it was. Now we're seeing it. Get back. No, you did not screw up. It's okay. Little jump in the gun. To be honest, but you know. So, but we got it worked out now. We'll just adjust. This makes sense. Okay. So I fucked up. Uh, we're going to watch one more trailer. We're going to redo the poll. Okay, guys? You ready? What if they went no and they all logged off right now? Well, it's... it's I don't actually have an answer. Okay. <laughs> and this is just odd coincidence, though, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, and this was submitted before. Um, we'll figure it out, guys. We'll figure it out. Um, so I burned somebody's trailer. So if you're looking and you're like, my trailer was played, but I... I'm already going on to the next round. I didn't. I shouldn't have my trailer played. You can submit another one if you like. You can sit, submit another one. But um, uh, all right, you guys okay? Yeah, yeah. All right, ready? We're playing this next one, which is it just kind of works out funny. Like Last that. year, audiences everywhere thrilled to a terrifying film about the horrors of home ownership. House. Now. There's an all new house. Looks like you got some kind of alternate universe in there or something. With brand new owners. Charlie. Hmm? Got it. And it's getting weirder. Look, it's a prehistoric bird. <laughs> I got you, Jack. I've seen enough tragedy and disaster to make you want to upchuck hey. these shorts. Two friends hey, inherit a guy from the Ellen house. Show. Charlie, yeah, there's know. jungle. No. And a 170-year-old mummy. Surprise! Who is this? You can call me Gramps. No. They're in for more trouble <laughs> than they ever imagined. You can kick the door open, run in there blindly, and I'll cover you, okay? <laughs> guy with the big gun goes first. <laughs> It's funny because this looks more like the Burbs. House 2, a second story. This place gives me the creeps. I'll get it. I get it. Damn. Because, like, second story. Yeah. That's All right. when you have stairs. Kooky. Yeah. But it's also like So another... it's funny that we had House and House 2, but the House, the sequel to the American remake of House. Right? That's pretty interesting, right? Is that what that is? That was the American remake of I, I have to assume. I mean, that's a big assumption that House, the American one, is a remake of the Jap Japanese. Oh, no, that's not a is. remake. So it's like even Sally says. It's so, not a remake? That's what it's the just chat a separate say. movie? It's called House? Yes. Okay. Oh. And House Party wasn't in that franchise. House Party? Yeah, that wasn't part of that franchise. I guess I didn't spell that right, did I? <laughs> I thought you were trying to write Air Buds. It's funny that these were all horror movies. Huh. Yeah, do it for two minutes because you already went pee. All right. I did take a piece. 
And it was good. No. Uh, Did you wash your hands? No. Ew, get off me! I have the cleanest penis in the world. I'm sure that's not true. Oh, that's disgusting. I bet it's filthy. Why? Because I saw you dipping it in mud earlier at the beach. It's not clean. It's clean mud. You fucking touched it. And yeah. You got dirty hands, apparently. I wash my hands before I pee. Don't want to get my penis dirty. Did you wash your hands? Ew. Before I pee? Uh, I've you? done no. that before. <laughs> 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 I've fully washed my hands before going to the bathroom because I was like, I'm not letting these hands even graze my thigh. Do you guys wash your hands when you pee in your own house? Yes. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Sometimes I don't flush, though. <laughs> Why don't you flush? Because in California, we don't have any water. So they don't let you flush? If it's yellow, let it mellow. That's what they used to say. <clears throat> okay. When so, we were little. Um, it's actually got really close for a second there. Um, Look at the tie. Yeah, is that? It's not over yet. If you're, if you're, if you're haven't voted yet. You yeah, but I'm not there, seeing any movement. Close, guys, guys, get in there. Do uh, a vote. Oh on wow! It. It, they both just both the the tie went up real quick. One right each, there. guys. Wow. Come on, get out there, wow. vote. Rock the vote. Yeah, you guys need to start having promos to get people to vote. Uh, oh wow! They're tied again. I think Chad's just fucking with us now. Yeah, I do too. They're trying to break our brains. Tied again. Jeez, yeah, me. guys, come on, rock the vote. Guys, it's me. Oh. All the limp biscuits. Oh, oh whoa, that was wow. a big surge. Okay. It's not getting caught. House there we go. House the original go. was the okay. winner. Who was house the first one? The first house came to us from Flanja. So Flanja is the winner of the losers, I guess. Is that what you're yeah, saying? Yeah, he's L1. You're a winner to me, guys. This was a good round of trailers. And it was great because there was like a theme to it, you know? Um, <clears throat> house, oh, and we know who House 2 was. House 2, Niamix, um Sorry if I blew up your spot there. Um, Killer Condom, which got 11 points. That came to us in third. That was Schwingles. And then uh, Nightbreed, which I'm surprised. Nightbreed and the Burbs tied. The Burbs, I am interested. But as a trailer, I, I don't know. I'm still kind of about it um of those two i thought nightbreed was cooler i haven't seen either of those i mean i haven't seen nightbreed at all the burbs i haven't seen since i was a little kid as i mentioned before but uh nightbreed looked more interesting but both of you guys have been eliminated i apologize to there's you. three of them that have been eliminated yes i'm getting there schwingles has also been eliminated and it looks like flanja and yamix are going on to the next round have you updated the pi the picture Did yet? Did you say uh, Zombie Bender's been eliminated? Did I say that? Zombie Bender, Schwingles, Christina, Christina Marie, Marie have been eliminated. Guys. It was a good game, guys. I appreciate it. You put in the effort. It was a close one. Sorry I fucked that up there. Um, but it did look like House 1 before. Okay, so here's what we got. For round one, we have Kit Black versus Flanja. For round two, Panwall versus Nyamix. And for round three, Legion Italia versus Marth. Are you uh, updating the picture? Do you want me to show it to... Uh... <laughs> You're getting drunk, huh? Uh, here, I'll, I'll, I'll guess. I'll, I'll send you this. Hold on. Let me talk to the participants. Talking to him in chat? 
Who, what? Yeah. They're watching, aren't they? Yeah, I guess they're watching, but I'm also, like, talking shit. No, I'm just kidding. Um, so, yeah, if you are... Okay, you've already sent yours. Sorry, guys. I mean, the problem is I, I fucked up because I uh, don't know everyone's name, and uh, I just was like, oh, this person that's probably sent it. Um, I think a few of you have submitted... No, Panwall, I think I got yours. It said second trailer. Uh, uh, hold on. Okay, it's sent. All the right. new the new graphic see the bracket right here oops no, it's know. called bracket three okay um oh okay. yeah wait there it is bracket three keep talking um yeah, guys, what an exciting night. What an exciting night. What a good show. Uh, yeah, and check us out on the YouTube. We're starting to put the videos up on YouTube. You guys are all part of this show. That's a good point. Um, you know, you may have noticed, like, you know, on the VOD channel, there's no Trailer Boys. Uh, and so we put up the first one recently unfortunately we didn't realize that like uh the vod channel on twitch they disappear they like delete after a while so we did lose a lot of them but starting at mother's day which was a pretty fun one the bad moms episode um that's up there now and it does always help unfortunately like i watch a lot of youtube videos and i'm like i have nothing to comment you know i have nothing to upvote or whatever but it, seeing the other side of it, you're like, oh, it really helps a lot when people like interact and upvote and, you know, uh, comment on it. So please uh, check it out because a lot of you are, are on these episodes as well. So we all win. We give you many shout outs. Other shout outs we should give out too. Uh, the logo here, uh, Future Reunion Tour, did a really good job there. Uh, the crazy saxophonist has helped us immensely with organizing this whole thing. We um, will possibly be changing up how we do things in season two to make it like easier, and more fun for everybody. So we'll figure that out. But so what it looks like right now is Kit Black versus Flanja, Panwall versus Niamix, and legit Legion Natalia versus Marth. So you guys send your trailers to me now. And we'll try and I'll try and not fuck up the head-to-head -head here. <laughs> um, okay, okay. Let me see. So this round, it's just two people competing. We won't say who's who, and it's just head-to-head. -head. And the winner goes on to the round of three. Okay. All right. And remember, if we watch a trailer and it's not, here's here's the other thing too. If we watch a trailer and you haven't submitted yet, like you may have submitted, but if we watch one and you submitted the same one, you have to pick another one. We're not doubling down here, so we're just going in random order. Um, okay. And you know what? Let's move the. We should move the groups around first. Let's not do Kit Black and Flanger next, and then everyone's gonna know it's them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The okay. the this is in no particular order. But those are the the groupings. Okay, and these are head. This is the first head to head round. Yeah, huh? first head to head. Sick. I'm celebrating. I haven't fucked up too bad yet, right? I mean, you got really drunk. Not yet. I'm just regular drunk. Eh. Oh, yep. I fucked up there. Hold on. <laughs> you know it's funny the other night uh yeah, that's it. <laughs> it's an off stream chat it's an off stream chat <laughs> yeah i know exactly what you're gonna say yeah. don't say it is it something i did no yeah but no fuck you yeah but no but did you watch um, but that's not come on on flagship the other night i don't know if anyone watched flagship but it was pretty funny because trevor got uh Ripped real early. That was a fun one. Uh, all right. On to the next round. All right. And remember, pay attention, because we're doing two and then voting, and then two and then voting. All right? I didn't do it. Why 
A daring robbery. A stolen jewel. An ancient curse that may alter the destiny of the world. Find him and get him. The Lost Empire. Three amazing women join forces to battle a supernatural demon at his hidden island fortress. Strange experiments. Secret powers. Shadowy devils bent on taking control of the entire planet. You're a dead man. Three outstanding warriors. Two mighty creatures. One incredible adventure. Get ready to meet your Omega, Wolf! <laughs> Get ready, the classic returns. The Lost Empire. What does that mean, the classic returns? <laughs> it's how you get people to watch your movie. Yeah, you're like, it's already a classic, so you probably should watch it, because someone's <laughs> going to make fun of you if you haven't seen it. The only thing I liked about that trailer was how accurate the fighting is. When people fight, it looks bad. Yeah. Like, it doesn't... If, when people fight in real life, it's not, like, slick or clean. It's, like, fumbly and fucked up and, like... I love it. Well, what about all the babes? Show me the thing again. Uh, right now, here it is. Um, that was that was cool. I had a lot of babes. Oh, I, I saw it. I have it here. I don't have to show chat. They wrote a list of all the babes that were in it. So yeah. they're showing each other the same list of babes right now. Yeah. It's depressing. It's, I have my own list of babes. It's cooler. It says blonde lady in skimpy outfit like four times. <laughs> the fact that you guys use the word skimpy yeah. makes me know you. neither of you get to fuck her. Oh, we do. Skimpy, you neither nerds. Of us. I didn't say skimpy. Skim it was on your list. Yeah. I just liked that it was four times. It was on your list, maybe more than four. Hey, I celebrate all women. Even skimpy ones? Even skimpy ones. Even the skimpies? Have we seen the movie Pandorum? Uh, I think I have. I'm going to say yeah. Why not? All right. Um, so that was the first head-to-head, -head, um, and that was called uh, The Lost Empire. So just to get everyone to remember The Lost Empire... Uh, interesting movie. I think that was some classic, classic Trailer Boys stuff. It was very, yeah, yeah. it's very classic Trailer Boysy. Cool. There was like a fake dick. Yeah, it shows the robot that was shooting the laser, like, had ball. It was like, that's a dick. Yeah, uh, yeah. A paging Dr. Freud. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. You should start saying that whenever something's so obvious. Right. Um, um, guys, you know what that looks like. There's a little like, something right? more Here's going on. Here's the next on. one, everyone. Every curtain. Someone is waiting. Someone is watching. Someone is hiding. What waits behind the curtains is exciting, frightening, sensual, terrifying. And bizarre. Jesus. Curtains reveal what you expect and what you don't. Curtains, the ultimate. Nightmare. Holy shit. That looked fucking scary. That was fun. That would have been a good one I like, for the voiceover uh, round. I that like the doll yeah. driving the car into her. Like, you stop, get out, 
she grabs you, and then she runs and gets in your car and runs you over. Oh, I thought it was like somebody else. Oh, was I it? I think it was someone else. Oh, yeah. I didn't see. I closed my eyes for a second. Because you were scared? Yeah. I know which one I'm voting for. I got shocked up. Uh, what should we call this round? Second round? Second second round? Head to head. Head to head. Head to head one. We'll just say the first head to head. Head to head Duo. one. Um, and it was The Lost Empire. Yeah. And curtains. Solid submissions, everyone. Solid submissions. If it wasn't for Venetian blinds, it would be curtains for us all. Piebald. Piebald. It's hey. a piebald album. Ugh. Emo! Double um, ugh. All right. all so, those. this is an interesting thing because they're off... Off theme, they're like not the same genre, which I think is really cool. Like a weird, like barbarian sci-fi future thing, which I think we've seen a few times. That's a genre I really like. We got to figure out. We got to nail what that genre is called. Oh, John's John's in chat. John Jackson's watching oh, the show. Oh, thank God! Who is so he? So if we need a, a, a John, where are you? A tiebreaker. John, I need him too. John, I told you that this would go past midnight. Your cousin John. I wonder ah, who it is. Cousin John. <laughs> Earlier, I was talking to John, and I was like, "Bud, you gotta eat dinner." And he was like, "Yeah." And I was like, "Yeah, the show's gonna be long." You don't have to eat dinner. Oh no, man, I, he was it's like, "I was gonna wait close. for you guys," and I was like, "Oh no, that's not happening. We're yeah. gonna take showers and then." Nate's going to eat his White Claw dinner, which yeah. he does prepare on a plate. Guys, this is so close to our first head-to-head. They're both really good trailers. Yeah, yeah, they, they were both, both were good. Really good. Um, this is a toffee. Should I wear on a white shirt? Did you guys plan that? Yeah. yeah. We debated even. We went, should we wear white? Should we wear black? I went, and we're like, Nate's wearing black. No, let's not wear black. Yeah, and we were like, well, we'll be too matchy-matchy. Let's just match. Let's okay. just match. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, Sam does like this sweatshirt, though. It's a very cool sweatshirt. He loves it. I don't know why. It's just a white V-neck sweater. This is, she loves this shirt it. that I have. I do like that shirt. Gap, uh, it's a slub shirt. We're in love. Curtains wins by six points. Curtain wins. Wow, this is what Whoa. it's all about. Is everybody okay out there? Cousin John, let us know. Okay, let us say that, um, let, let's explain to people, Curtains was submitted by Kip Black. Kip Black, on to the final round. Uh, and who's there we go. Lost Empire. Uh, Lost Empire was submitted by Flanja. Flanja, thank Flanja, you. Flanja, very good submission. Too but, bad, so sad. He's so rough on them. I know, I know. you're so mean. Just I know. what a terror. Are, this is dope content. These guys submit some good shit. I'm um, going to send everyone who didn't win trophies. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Damn. That'd yo. be so expensive. No, I think we'll do three trophies, right? Should we do I the top three? Everyone who didn't win. Everyone. I mean, that's well, only, only ten, 10 people. Trophies. That's true. Should we let's do participation see, awards? Let's see how much they are first. <laughs> Should we give chat a trophy? Let's see how much they are. Okay. Um, let so me that, wait, that was in. Kip Black? Yeah, Kip Black. On to the next. What if there are $100 a piece? <gasps> Thank you for the what happened? One sub. Thanks, Great Noir. <laughs> the Great Noir great gifted noir. our cousin. Or here's Aww. the other thing. Great Noir. We don't even know if that's actual our cousin. You know, like no, it is. <laughs> it's he gotta be. Me. Who else would Who else would claim to be your cousin, John? Anybody? Have you met Chat? I mean, they're but all pieces. They would have had to ch kidding. Like, you're my favorite. They would have had to be like, oh, uh, at some point. Their cousin John's gonna text them and say he's watching. That I'm gonna grab like this name real quick, and he's gonna say it's me, your cousin John. He's gonna text them to tell them he's on. All right, you guys ready for this one? Next head to head, head to head two. <gasps> oh yeah, he wants us to ask him something only the real cousin John would know. What's, uh, what's, what's your nickname? What, your new yeah, nickname. what's your nickname? But if he tells Chat, then all Chat's gonna know. They're no, gonna no, 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 no. This is good. Don't talk him. What's your new nickname? It's a new nickname. Right, but we're not going to say the whole thing. It's just his nickname. Nobody can tell from that. 
It's only one name. I should know. Well, why he thinks while he thinks that we're gonna watch the next trailer. You guys ready for okay. that? Shout Factory TV, changing the channel. These ones are quiet, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, it's trailer. not him. He's in honey buns. Ah, there it is. Okay, yeah, hey, it's that. You're fucking deaf or something. You know something, kid? I get tired of listening to you. That's what you always say. <laughs> That's what you always say. He's not Mad Max, he's Angry Jeff. Stop it, cut out. Sooner, later, Jojo. There's like no music anymore. Yeah, I ran out of, <laughs> ran out of music. <laughs> There's another like minute of how the music comes in. Right. How do you want to just like end it now? Slow fade. How slow? The slowest. Shrigle says he got knocked out already and now his wife is sleeping and he's horny and angry. It's a bad combination. <laughs> for well, everyone. For you. For Being everyone. Horny and angry is great. Teach your dick who's boss, sir. Um, that... I like that genre. I think we've seen a few similar things. Like, I, I vibe that, you know? Moist Mob is now following. Love the name, Moist Mob. That's sick. Um, <laughs> I thought I said Moist Mom. And I was like, good for her! <laughs> no. Good for her! No, 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 no. Um, okay, let's see who is going up against this one. Uh, ta -ta 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 -ta. 
Trata, are you still there? Travis Taylor. Just checking in. Is it doxing if we say his name, even though his like, yes. username is like his name? No, yeah, it is. No, Still sorry is. about that, Travis. I feel doxed when you use my first name. D, De Laurentiis Entertainment Group. You got the Hold on tight. The most incredible rock and roll adventure ever is here. Feed him to the shark guns. Starring Judd Nelson as Hot Rod. <laughs> Leonard Nimoy as... Galvatron and Orson Welles. I am the The guy was in the kid with like the rocket skate. Beyond good, beyond beyond, beyond your wildest imagination. <laughs> Transformers the movie. <laughs> The movie. Coming to a theater near you this August. I had this poster as an adult when I first moved into my own apartment, uh, and I loved it. It's just funny because it has like Leonard Nimoy and Orson Welles and some other you know well-named dudes. And I had the DVD, and DVDs used to have chapters back in the day. Yeah. And um, there's one where the the uh, human guy says shit in the movie. And it was called, the chapter was called The Bad Word. <laughs> and I always thought that was hilarious. Um, all right, so that is our next head to head. Uh, head to head two. And uh, exterminators, what was it called? Sorry. Exterminator 3000. Exterminators. I don't know if it's going to let me write all that. Exterminators. You don't have to write out 3000. 3K. Oh, there we go. Well, it's Exterminators of the Year 3000. Right, but you're like T H R E E T H. Did I break your thing? You might have. Uh, it's a laptop, whatever. It only cost me a million dollars, but, you know, it's a one-of-a-kind thing. Oh, there we go. I just needed to charge up a bit. Don't worry, I can fix it, probably. All right, cool. Um... I don't know what you guys thought of those trailers. I enjoyed both of them. I also liked that they were like, I mean, I guess they're both sci-fi-ish, but they were yeah. not the same genre What was at the all. first one? Exterminator 2000. 2000. It was like um, the Mad Max-y kind of thing. I that loved, was good. I like, like that one. There was, it was long. I yeah. will say, but it was long. I feel like a very early, like, Trailer Boys, before it was even Trailer Boys, it was us, like, playing video games and then stopping like video games to watch movie trailers and what like the first one of the early ones we were just watching movies that were like blatant ripoffs of mad max movies and that was like the whole day we we're like we should do a show out of this and we we're like yeah and then um and then uh here we are doing the show out of it so that was a that was a chill remember when it wasn't trailer boys yeah what was it called uh Tra trailer Babies? <laughs> Solar Babies, though, was one of the original trailers that we watched. Remember that? All right. Okay. So we're voting here. Ooh, it's close. Ooh. Not, well, it's 21 to 32. So if you if you haven't voted yet, you know, we only have like 53 votes in right now. So there's definitely room for more votes. It's uh, it's getting down there. I wonder if people wait until the last second to throw all their votes in to like you know. The last one definitely kind of had that like uh, uh, 
all the votes kind of came right at the end. Boom! 60% of the votes, that's 36 of you, have voted for Transformers the movie. 24 of you, 40% of the votes, Wrong voted choice, for guys. Exterminators 3000. What were you voting for there? I was voting for the other one. Really? Yeah, I thought it was Did really you know? silly. I liked Exterminators 3000, but I feel like in that sphere, there were some that were more mm-hmm. interesting. And I don't know, I think some of the chat didn't like how long it was. Yeah. Um, in Transformers the movie, it's fucking tight. It has the. It is, good I tune know, but now. I'm like, it's Transformers the movie. It has that it's, song. That song a, that's from that's in uh, Boogie Nights. It's just a little. Yeah. It's a I thought that was a Boogie Nights song, and when I found out that was like a real song, I was like, what the fuck? So, just to let you guys know, that was Professor Marth live going into the next round. And unfortunately, that means we have lost Legion Italia. Another one bites the dust. Yeah. Ooh. Excellent work. This season, Legion Italia, don't let it get you down. Legion Italia, one of my faves. Yeah. yeah. He's in, I think he's I in mean, the top three, too. Legion There's Italia, though, every giant single fucking trailer, boys. I'm like, Legion's <sighs> almost going to win. Just good picks. Just good picks. Trata, yeah, I was calling you. I'm glad you heard me. Okay. So that means this final match, should I say who it is? Because it's. I mean, everyone can use the can process deduce, of elimination. Yeah, that it is. We have Panwall versus Niamix. Niamix. Panwall versus Niamix. Yeah, Legion, you're correct. They didn't. But we don't know. We don't know which one we're going to see. We don't know. If this is the Panwall trailer or the Neomix trailer. Aw, Cousin John said thank you for the gift to Great Noir. Aw. Aw. Somebody please give Sub John a sub to my channel. (laughs) Is it possible through this chat? Please, thank you. Are you guys ready for the last head-to-head? Yeah. Investigate the meteor, if indeed that is what it is. Oh, ooh. It's a rock that bleeds. Now that's peculiar. It's too amazing to even contemplate it. It's like they're evolving. A little baby seem to be growing up. Well, I hope they don't make it to puberty. <laughs> The bug in my suit! You're all sealed up, that's impossible! Don't tell me I'm sealed up, I know there's a bug in my... Ooh, it's in me! <laughs> Get this thing out of me! Hey, Harry. Ooh. How are you going in? I might be able to catch it in his colon. All right, flip it! <laughs> I'll get the lubricant. There's no time for lubricant. There's always time for lubricant! This summer, is there some sort of alien attack happening here? Have a nice end of the world. Evolution. Good googa mugga. Come on, cutie pie. David Duchovny, Orlando Jones, Sean William Scott. Awesome! And Academy Award nominee, <laughs> Julianne Moore. <laughs> oh. I'm okay. I'm okay. Uh oh. Time to go. Evolution. So, what do you want? Lightly or dark? You have to ask? <laughs> That was like the original trailer with like the date and stuff in it, you know? Yeah. I love that. I actually love that movie and I'm super pumped that that somebody submitted that because it's a weird movie and um, I love Sean William Scott. I think he's hilarious. 
That was a that was a fun trailer because they did the whole thing with the Oscar moment with Julianne Moore and like had that joke in <laughs> yeah. it. Um, I like do you know um, Donkey Lips from Salute Your Shorts? Isn't oh it? yeah. And then Ethan Suple, I think they're like brothers. It it made me think. Where did Orlando Jones go? I think it was canceled. No. Yeah. Kept telling people to seven up yours. Mm hmm. Because he was in that commercial when this movie came out. That's how it's. That's, I think that was the only thing he did before. Also, Orlando Jones was in my favorite movie of all time, Drumline. The Replacements. The Replacements is up there. Drumline, <laughs> no, is my shit. Uh, but yeah, Sean William Scott, uh, somebody said he was great in Goon. He was great in Goon 2 as well. I didn't even know. Lesser known sequel, unfortunately. I don't think I've watched all of Goon 2. I think I started it's it. Fun. But. It's fun. Um, all right, so that was a good one. Because that, you know, we haven't had a lot of comedies. Yeah. No, I like that one. So that was fun. Um, let me see. Do, 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 do. Ba, da, de, da, ba, da, da. Okay. Julianne Moore doing comedy is always really weird to me. Yeah. Yeah. I love her in a drama, but when she does comedy, I'm always like, what's happening? Because she always has that part where she goes up to the guy at the drugstore and she's like, don't you fucking judge me. Yeah, and we're, I'm like, were we supposed to laugh? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? He's like, oh, you're having a party. With yeah, yeah, girls. pretty she's like, fun Yeah, weekend. I like to fucking party. Mm -hmm. Shut up, you <laughs> fucking nerd pharmacist. You want to party? You shouldn't have become a pharmacist. It's Pat Healy. My favorite comedy sci-fi? All sci-fi is comedy, baby. Are right, you ready? Yeah. For the last head-to-head? -head? Or of this round, at least. I gotta ask that, guys. I'm not sure. The entire town of Pahuta is tuned to Superstation 66. Please, this bump's killing me! That was funny. But while dangerous Dan O'Dare is rocking the airwaves, a disc jockey from outer space is about to change the frequency to total terror. Can you believe this guy? What a maniac. <laughs> He's offering a prize to any beautiful woman who's listening. Hey, whatever you're doing, it's intense. A one-way trip to another <laughs> galaxy. It really sucks! It was one of those things you don't quite see. Aliens are using my voice to aim the machinery. Oh my god. Turn off your radios, people. They're doing it again. Bad channel. In space, no one is safe from rock and roll. <laughs> Damn, that had everything I like. Babes, robots, aliens, <laughs> heavy metal nuns. That's all you like. It's yeah. weird. Heavy why metal nuns? Why can't Nate find a a girlfriend. He is only <laughs> attracted to heavy metal nuns. Heavy metal yeah. nun, alien robot. What was the other yeah, thing? Yeah, you Babes. need a new Tinder profile, man. Yeah. I like four things. <laughs> Babes, robots, aliens, heavy metal nuns. And more babes. And more babes. <laughs> Twins? <laughs> Quads? <laughs> Scared. <laughs> Quads? All right, That's so That's too many sisters. That was that this is also a really crazy round. We got some crazy rounds. Can you hold on to the computer? First? I would fucking <laughs> love to. Uh, I've been wanting it ever since. It babe, it shouldn't be that dramatic. It's you have so like No, no, no. It's it's cuz it, 
I'm sitting on the edge and it's making my legs. Sitting on the edge. That is how that song goes. I wish that's how that song hey, went. Sitting on the edge. Yeah, yeah, not much going on. Just sitting on the edge. Uh, the poll is up, everybody. If you're not much of a poll watcher or user, check the chat. Go all the way up to the top where it says head to head three. What's wrong with babes, though? Can I not say that? Is what that not mean? a 2021 thing to say? I'm into babes. Is that like a controversial opinion? That shouldn't be an edgy thing. Or is it? Or is it? Heavy metal mountains. Is I, that where it gets sketchy? He, say you're not allowed to say heavy metal mountains <laughs> because it just gives everyone instant boner or instant gush. I love how though that trailer like hit the heavy metal nun. Like look, I saw it for like a split second in the beginning, and I was like, "Well, that was weird." And then like later, it's like surfing a gurney in a hospital. Like woo! Heavy metal used to be fun, you know, and now it's like corny because everyone tries to be like really dark and like dangerous, and you're like. Eh. We should start a fun heavy metal band. I get what you're getting at, brah. I'm in. I'll drum. You gotta have your friend Steve produce it. If I really called him and said, um, and he would go, I'm not a producer, I'm an engineer. Is that what he says? Yeah. Wow. That's... Yeah. That's why he doesn't take points. What does that mean, take points? He doesn't take points on fucking albums. And that's why he's not a gazillionaire. That's crazy. He thinks it's unethical. Oh, I guess He's so. real public about it. He says it in lots Steve of Steve Albini, articles. everyone, we're talking about. She's friends with Steve Albini. Uh, Slint. He texted me today. He didn't text me today. Do you want me to give him your number? He'll text you. That'd be, I'd be like, I wouldn't know what to say. You should just come to Chicago. I'm about to go stay with them. You should just come visit. There's, big, big there's plenty of bedrooms. Big black, huh? Big Black he is he is and the winner is 33 votes 57% of the votes evolution Ooh. evolution was submitted Thanks, to babe. us by Niamix Niamix that means Niamix. a titan has gotten <laughs> a, 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 a titan. titan has fallen wow wait was that legion wow no, Panwall. Panwall? Pan what the Pan fuck? Panwall, wow. Bad. Panwall went out, and sorry to say, it wasn't even close, Panwall. You got aced, brother. Here's what I think happened. I, I guess it was close. I'm sorry. I, I don't know if that. anyone pointed this out, but uh, that one was on the show before. Bad channel. Yeah, Bad fucking literally everyone was... pointed it out. Oh, sorry, I didn't see it. Literally 80,000 people in chat wrote, that was seen before. And my response to that is, who gives a shit? And the band sketches. Who really? gives a shit? Band Do sketches. you guys think that Nate's pulling up these emails and then cross-referencing the 4,000 trailers that have been shown? <laughs> guys, not everybody's seen every show. It doesn't matter. Man. Is that true? We watched it? Apparently it's been seen before. The chat Damn, nearly that's crazy. Had, I don't remember that though. Had a, a million infants. Wow, Panwall. Janialist, wow. no, you did not work with Steve Albini's wife. Who are you? That's my best friend. Wow. Oh, I'm so excited about this. So, Sam, do you want to come in and tell us how the next round works? All right, next round, we have three people. We now have Professor Marth. We have Niamix. And we have, I forget who the third person was. Em Emily's got the computer. Oh, Emily. Right. Yeah, the computer. I'm trying to keep it safe. Uh oh. Sam was supposed to keep track, guys. I am. Uh, I need the pin code. Kit Black. Kit Black, yeah. Let me. So how does the next round work? We watch each, each of them submit one trailer. Okay. We vote between the three. Okay, so Kit Black. And all you're trying to do here is not lose. Okay, Kit Black, Nyamix, Professor Martha Liv. Please submit one trailer. Big gulps, huh? I love that line. Oh. 
All right. Um, why don't you talk while I check the emails? Sam, talk. He pointed to oh, he was talking to me. He well, I was pointing to, to both of you guys. No, he pointed to you. You only had one finger up. You should have pointed yeah, to both of us both like of this. Us with that. Yes. You should have hit us with That's a double, how you gotta bro. Do it. Hit us with a double. That's how you gotta do Night it. Night anus. Love you, cutie. I am Jay Nihilist Gialio. I was in Chicago and I bartended in Second City, begging for stage time. But ended up back at Spike's Rap. <laughs> oh, buddy. Very fun. Do you know any of these words he's saying? Yeah, I, did, I, I didn't work at Second City because I was too dark. Um, <laughs> so, uh, but, I mean, I did, though. I've done stuff there. But, uh, yeah. So I wouldn't be surprised whoa, if uh, whoa, we Raging ran Polly. into each other. Dragon Polly going off Gifting again. subs everywhere, left and right. Keep, keep, keep talking. Keep no, talking. no, no. That's good. That's a lot of gifts. We got to take a pause for it. Um, yeah, that's funny. We might have ran into each other. It depends on what years you were there. Okay, somebody somebody put final trailer, but I just want to remind them that if you win, there's another trailer. So everybody in the final three should be looking for another trailer. Um, are you ready? Sure. So just to remind chat, um, this should is the person who who does the person who said final trailer want to do a different trailer? No, I'm not giving them that option. All right. Oh. <laughs> so what happens here is it's a it's a three person elimination, and it's three it's head to head to head, right? Does that make sense? And then what happens is the person who loses you get third place, and then we go to a head to head. We have one more round for two more people, um, and this we could do. Let's just do let's just do one movie each. Okay. Now. And yeah, okay. The but oh no, I was saying like we could bring them into Discord. Oh yeah, we could. After we'll figure that out. Maybe we won't do that. I don't know. All right. Um, are right, you guys ready? Yeah, I am. Are you ready? No, let's wait. Right. Nate, are you ready? What should we wait for? Nothing. Okay, we're going. All right. Uh, oh, it feels so much better to sit in a real seat. It's funny though <laughs> when chat goes against like what you feel, you know, and I'm like, oh, like not. Hey, the first I love round, evolution. But the first I was round, like, I was like, you're correct on all these. On the very first round, we that's did. That's crazy stuff. It was all the ones oh. I voted for. All right, we're going again. Yeah, Nate's like, this is so weird. I have the best taste. Now. Break new day sensation. Light and free now. Well, somebody enough. pandering to me. Is never enough of the stuff. The spark, the taste that makes you hungry for more. The stuff, taste that delivers. We interrupt this presentation with the following urgent message. Tonight, Sipenace. America is in grave danger. We are under alien attack. By a popular dessert known as the stuff. Here, Jason, take some. No, don't eat that. There is something alive in there. Tasty. There's something alive in yogurt. It's called benign bacteria. What? If the stuff is in your house, yes. do not eat it. That's so weird. Yeah. <laughs> if you have it on your shelves, do not sell it. If you distribute this material, close your doors, make no more sales. Enough is ever enough. Dang. Pretty fucking dope. Yep. Somebody That's a hot said. Trailer. Somebody said, what if yogurt was killer cut? <laughs> um, what if I don't know I tried some, it. something about myself uh, a friend of mine told me I have to see that movie and lent me his copy of the DVD and I never watched it and never returned his DVD Jordan? no where's the DVD now? it just seems like I a Jordan know. movie I think I threw it away it was uh, Keith Malone lent oh. me that when I lived in New York 
Where's that? Teeth. 18 years ago. Where is that? It's uh, south of Boston. Mm. Um, also, it, I don't know if there are any New Englanders. I don't know if Fluffernutter is a thing in the country, but where I used to live in Somerville, they invented this thing called Fluffernutter, and it's pretty much like a whipped marshmallow that you put on peanut butter, uh, like in peanut butter sandwiches, um, and that's what it looks like. Uh, everyone I know from Massachusetts eats f- fluff sandwiches. Can you with buy it peanut butter of... and fluff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, fluff. I think actually, no. I don't... Oh, wait, no, you can get it some places. places yeah. But um, a friend of mine who is from, I think, Waltham. Does that sound real? Waltham. Waltham. <laughs> you guys say shit weird, so I don't know what stuff is. I'm always What's it like... called? Walthauser? Yeah. You guys, you guys know somebody from Wolfton? We name stuff after the how the natives named it to honor them. Okay? No, you guys only name stuff with W's. You think it's yeah. the only letter there is? Water Town. Because the Native Americans called them that. They way. called them water. They called yeah. it Water Town. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Water Town, Waltham, Massachusetts. It was weird that they had the same word for water that. That the English had. They didn't know that what they... it was before that. They, had, they... <laughs> what? Wet they stuff. hadn't seen the ocean. They called it wet stuff, and they're like, "We call that water." And they were like, "Good, oh, all right, water town." This was this, this is was wet the wet stuff, stuff town. town. Yeah, yeah. Wet stuff town. <laughs> now, and like, no, 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 let's do what? Wet stuff just sounds a little. Yeah. Sounds like a fluff sandwich. <laughs> all right, guys, uh, we're going to the next triple header. More frightening than his War of the Worlds. More imaginative than his time machine. Now, H.G. Wells' masterpiece of science fiction, The Food of the Gods. The terrifying tale of man fighting for his life against an ecology gone berserk. This is the last chance for an unsuspecting world against harmless animals and insects made huge and vicious by The Food of the Gods. Marjo Gortner. That one yeah. real. That did not look like a fake rat getting more. Ralph Peter. Yeah, I didn't like that. <laughs> Ida Lupino. <laughs> Nate also thinks this part looks good. H.G. Wells' The Food of the Gods for a Taste of Hell. Rated PG. That was very short. A... H.G. Wells. I've never heard of that one, have you? I think it no. felt shorter because they talked about all of the other books he's written first. <laughs> <laughs> and so the trailer got cut short because of that. Is Food of the Gods about rats? Are rats the gods and they eat humans? Is that the food? Basically, I guess. Has anyone in chat seen this movie? That's what I gathered from it. I do like how they did the mat you know, stuff where it's like they're using real rats, you know? Yeah. Like that, that oh, yeah. Funny. I just want to cool be the guy who builds the tiny house the rats get to run on. Rats are run outside gods. of. <laughs> Rats are gods. H.G. Wells. He did War of the Worlds. I always get Orson Welles and H.G. Wells confused because the same H.G. Thing. Wells wrote War of the Worlds, but Orson Welles did the radio. Yeah. yeah. Radio play? That always fucks me up. Right. Yeah, it fucks some other people up, too. And the last triple header of the evening. When they played it on the radio, people thought shit was real. Yeah, and they came into my house and told me aliens were coming. Yep. And then I had to, to suck, suck all their dicks. You know what's funny is I was always like, I wonder if they that could do that so now in real life, you know, like a kind of War of the Worlds thing to cause panic. And then I realized I'm like, yeah, that could definitely happen. No, like, it, was, it happened <laughs> like with that. The insurgents Hawaii. of like the capital on like the. You no, know, remember that six. Hawaii warning? Hawaii? So there was like some crazy like mass text that went out that was like some terrifying warning of some fucking doom and like everyone in Hawaii got it. Yeah, and they're like, "Oh, we weren't supposed to send that out." So. Yeah. Yeah, but still. But it was basically life, like QAnon you're, it was like, pretty much like an you're all dead. thing, right? You know, like. I mean, all of it. It's all. It's all happened before. It's all coming back, guys. It's just. A circle and a cycle, and life's a nightmare. A circle of life. Enjoy the highway. All right, we're into the last... Wait, did we do the last one already? No, we got one more. We got one more. Okay. (laughs) 
After seven months of fighting, the civil war in Chateloup may have reached the turning point. The capital has just fallen. In December 1994, the forces of freedom will face a power-mad dictator in a struggle for the fate of the world. to kick Bison's ass. I don't think so. You have to there? do better than that. Okay. Yes! Now, who wants to go home so. and who wants to go with me? Oh my God, right. But there's somebody who is an action star who like punched an extra or something on set? Bruce Lee? I feel like it's a story I heard from someone who was there, so maybe it's not known. <laughs> oh, wait, I, I, feel like, I feel like I heard this. I think you've heard, I feel like, yeah. Is it him or is it the other one? What's this one's name? Jean-Claude Van Damme. Or what's the and what's the other Steven one? Seagal. I think it might be that one. <laughs> okay. They're the same person. I also love that. Like, I'm a big Raúl Julia fan. Um, and it's funny how he was like in this movie, and he did uh, was a presumed innocent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. And then like um, uh, Adam's Family Values, the second one is an amazing movie, and he's so fucking good in that. And he died too young. Um, and uh, I just love that he was in this, and he would probably. I wonder. I wonder if he had paid a ton of money for this. All right, so the poll is up for the head to head to head what reminder. Are you, what are you about for? Oh, myself. We have the Am stuff, oh. which is kind of like a horror movie blob type of thing, um, which was cool looking, and then we have Food of the Gods, which was the H.G. Wells rat based movie, and then we have. Street Fighter, which was uh, based on a video game. I don't know if any of you guys seen that, but um, it uh, uh, was a fighting game. It was pretty good. These all have, th there's a theme that runs through this. Yeah. And that's uh, food. So the stuff's about food. And food of the god. Yeah, there's food. And Street Fighter, you, you used to play that at the pizza place. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm definitely voting the stuff. Min Na Wen, though, that was, was fun. such a babe. So That was fun. There was, so I guess, do you remember that guy in the movie The Program? And it's weird because I brought up The Program earlier. Yeah. Uh, the guy who played the steroids guy. No. Uh, he was like, he like painted his face like a skull in one scene and he took steroids and he like, Headbutted a car window when he got on like the starting line or something. Okay. Uh, that that actor played someone in in the Street Fighter movie. I forget who, but the the guy, the sumo wrestler guy. Guys, me. we're getting raided. Oh, who are we getting raided by? Paul. Oh. Paul the ball. Paul the ball. Who's Paul the ball? He's raiding us. I love Paul it. Paul the ball. Hey! Raid. This is the raid. Quick, song. if you guys raided. Oh, you know what I want for my I thing? Got a raid that song anytime now. someone raids, a bunch of cockroaches cover the screen. Remember those commercials? <laughs> raid! Oh, raid. All right, so, That's the good. stuff won, resoundingly, the stuff won. Thank you for the raid, Paul. And oh, is John Jackson on? Is our cousin John on? Are you dumb? Remember, we weren't going to dox Paul the Ball. <laughs> it's the real news, Paul says. And um, 
Is Jack Jack? Here's the problem, guys. Is Jack Jack on. Food of the Gods oh and Street God. Fighter both tied with seven points. They both tied. How crazy is that? You know? Oh, Jack Jack's on. Okay, Jack Jack. 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 You saw Food of the Gods and Street Fighter. Which one did you like? You get to pick one. Come on, Jack Jack. It's our, our intern, Jack Jack. Uh, intern? Int. He's more than an intern. Or PA. I think he's more than a PA at this point. What is he? Are you going to suddenly give Jack Jack a title? Is he yeah, an AP? Sure. I said that Jack. But I said that he's Jack Jack boy. is going to be my new producer. Okay. Because you guys are making him a producer. PA. Jack Jack. See, the thing though is, like, he doesn't know anybody. So this is the greatest thing: is he doesn't know who submitted the trailers. He watched the trailers, so uh, the stuff is in. So he watched Street Fighter and Food of the Gods. So um, he's got to choose which one. This is tough, but I'm going to go with Food of the Gods. Wow. Dang. Samurai, yes, correct. Personally, I would have gone with Street Fighter. Like, that was my shit. Of the round, I was like, Street Fighter's my thing. But this Food of the Gods uh, was pretty cool. It was cool. I haven't seen it before. The thing with Street Fighter is, I mean, obviously, a lot of us have seen it. So, um... Uh, Niamix picked Street Fighter. Niamix, you had a good run. A good, solid run. Yeah, you did great. Sam, Sam called you a loser, but not us. I, um, the stuff... Oh, yeah. The stuff you came to us... You call everyone who loses a loser. <laughs> the stuff was submitted to us by Professor Mark Liv, who uh, got the most points there. Second place in the tiebreaker... Decided by cousin Jack was by Kit Black, Food of the Gods. So that's where we're at now. <laughs> so the so, MX is the bronze medalist. Yes. And so now we're ready for the finals. It is Kit Black versus Professor Mark. So is there a different way um, that we score the finals? Uh, yeah, we have the audience vote. So no, there's not a different way. Oh, really? That's how we did the other rounds? Yeah, I don't know. I thought you had something else. Sorry. Sorry, guys. No, no, we were originally going to do more than one trailer, but it's it's late. Okay. It's very late. Okay. Well, I still have, like... Oh, shit. Let's keep going, then. Oh, whoa. Nate has more alcohol. Yeah, Sam! You can only drink it on stream? Yes. Yeah. Honestly. Why? It's more fun that way. Okay. So... Uh, Panini Meanie said, "Have a good night." Brown Town. Brown Town. Um, Thank you, Panini. Meanie. Bye, Panini. So, uh, Professor Marth and Kit Black, please submit your final trailers of the night. This is it, everyone. This is the head to head. Panini Meanie, you're gonna miss the last two trailers of the night for the winner of the season. They finished their one. drink already. And if I, if I have any advice for you guys, it's don't hold back this round. Do you, do you think they were holding back before? Yeah, I think they were like, they, you know, you have to like pace yourself and you're like, oh, I don't want to, you know, blow my load. And uh, and so now you, you don't have to save it for anything. Just that's my advice to you. Just go all out. Guys, submit four more trailers each. Is your is your suggestion to blow the loads now? Yeah, now you got to stop edging. Blow the load. A little too much. A little too much what? You know. What? Okay. Um, let me see what we have here. All right, you guys ready? Nobody said anything when I said, are you, are you guys ready? It's I'm not ready. Almost one. <laughs> what if somebody just decided to like, 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 like
Spring Break no, in Fort Lauderdale. Yeah. 250,000 kids here for the sole purpose of partying. <laughs> Nelson Delby and Adam Stern are about to get the break of their lives. Spring Break. For some, it's the start of a whole new education. There's a woman not wanting water on this. Are you making sexy? Oh, my God. For others, it's a more advanced <laughs> course. You can learn a foreign language. Or expand your present one. You can learn martial arts. Home economics. And guides for your protection. Culinary arts. And all sorts of sports. There's something for those into the performing arts. And something for those into nature. Oh, Nelson! Columbia Pictures presents Spring Break. It's the reason kids go to college in the first place. I still don't know where my underpants are. <laughs> Why, what happened to them? I think they ate them. <laughs> I think this genre of movies has to come back. Oh God! Hard bodies. Twenty twenty one. What was what was the? <coughs> there was a Spring Break movie that there was this whole. It was like very like comedy like that, but there was this whole subplot of like a murder. Are you asking chat? Yeah. No, no, I don't know. It was like a, a Spring Break. I know what movie. you're talking about. I just am not going to tell you. Do you really? No, fuck no. no. Uh, the slasher spring. Break. No, no, not Club Dread. It was, it, it was like it was the same period as that Spring Break movie. It looks very similar. Correct, Nomad. And I've got just the script. All right, but it's inside I this cage. I liked that. That's my genre. That's my wheelhouse and my lane and my vibe and all those things. Okay, but. Uh, t- also, I, I will bored. say, I didn't understand what that movie was about. It wasn't about anything. I was bored. So I feel like Hard Bodies, which we have watched on here, had like some kind of plot to it, you know? Um, I, that one just seemed kind of I bet you like it. porn with a story. <laughs> yeah. I think Blood, Blood Beach sounds right. Uh, yeah. Like Blood Beach. Did we watch Blood Beach on this, though? We did watch something where somebody kept getting killed and they were ending up in the same... I think it was Blood Beach. Oh, that was Blood Beach. Oh, so it wasn't Blood Beach. I'm thinking of it. Gulia? All right, you guys ready for the last one of the night? Yeah. Okay. We're going head-to-head, guys. Don't move. What are you going to do, shoot me? So they call it Samurai, huh? <laughs> His I real name is free. Joe Marshall. They call him Samurai. He speaks fluent Japanese. Omaha, Yamaha, whatever his face, his name is, right? <laughs> Are you oh Fuji, God. Fujiyama? He got his martial arts training from the masters in Japan. He was brought over here from the police force in San Diego to fight us. I want him dead! I want his head cut off and brought here! I want his head on this piano! <laughs> I will bring you his head and I will place it on your piano. And we'll see who the real Samurai is. Uh, 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 uh. So damn. See an arm. God damn you damn. guys! All you've done is cost me bloodshed and mayhem. Who hired you? Tell me who hired that you. That guy on fire! Come on. Is that hey, Police! Don't move! You're under arrest. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Hey, he can get the door you, open. <laughs> Well, this one's dead, too. Not captured alive. Have you been circumcised? Well, your doctor must have cut a big portion of it off. No, he, uh, he was a good doctor. <laughs> now, I'm telling these son of a bitches that if they continue killing our children, <laughs> I'll have their stinking bodies in Robert garbage bags and ship them back to Japan for fertilizer. Got it? Yeah. I do got it. Yeah. Samurai cop. Sa- it's Samurai Cop, guys. Come on. Come on. <laughs> I'm voting Samurai Cop. Come on. And it hurts. 
Alright, hold on. Come up my ass. So I felt like good. Somebody stuck, did you say come up my ass? Yeah. I feel like somebody stuck a big club up my ass. Oh. And it club. hurts. I've got to figure out a way to get it out of there. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I know you can't say who did that, but that was. I love. I love the line fun. when she's like uh, about asking what circumcised. He was like, "No, he was a good doctor." It's like he was like overly defensive that was about great. it. Was like, you know, ooh. like a fifth of his dick got cut off. <laughs> he was a great doctor. No, he was. You, my <laughs> uncle did it. All right. So uh, there's this. After this, there, there's a scene we should pull up that's, uh, it's, I think it's on YouTube as the worst act, acted scene ever, and it's that scene between I think we've two. watched it, though, right? Have we watched it on Because we were talking about doing a, a watch party, a watch which we party still could of, do we this could week. Still, yeah, maybe maybe next week we can... Tonight! As the, the season ender, we'll do a watch party of, a, of a, someone, because I know they have... Not Samurai Cop, but I know they have the the guy that made that next movie is on Amazon Prime. What about? I mean, Which I, I think it's like American. On. I bet someone who wins this whole thing would have some good ideas too. Okay. Of what to watch. What should we call this? The trailer of but the season. Watch. Trailer champion. Trailer. Champ trailer ruler. Yeah. Trailer champion. Spring Break, which has two things I like. Boobs. Get it? Because there's two of them? Not it's always. It has the four things I like. What's that? Four, four boobs? Four things I like. Babes, babes, and more babes. I like that. That was only three things. Yeah, that was only three things. <laughs> there's a lot of babes. You couldn't even count, you couldn't even count it to four. No, no. Hold on, hang on! Okay, guys, um, we're going to put this in for three minutes so everyone gets a chance to vote. We're going spring break head-to-head -head with Samurai Cop. Good luck, everyone. Um, this is exciting. It was a fun season. As, as, as we get in here, let me say, this has been a fun time. I appreciate um, everybody. If you haven't watched the show before, we always say, you know, we'd have no show if it wasn't for you guys submitting trailers. So uh, it is much appreciated. I mean, I bet you guys could find some trailers. I'm kidding. How are you doing the thing with the... He's got the thing, the sheet around him. Oh, oh I was like, weird. It's like a floating hand. Um, but yeah, no, this has been a fun season. Um, here's the thing, too, while while we're, uh, we're doing this stuff. Um, again, we do have a Discord channel now. Thank you to the, the Discord hey. admins. Shout outs to Notcher who added a Trailer Boys channel. And you'll if, if you're a casual Trailer Boys watcher, you'll see a lot of the <laughs> same people in the chat. And you'll see them also in Discord and everyone's talking about movies. Hey, have you seen this? Um, so you know, you know, some cool stuff. I think um next week though, I think you're traveling, right? Yeah. So I don't think there's a show no, next week. No, no, we're not going till Tuesday. Yeah, the, oh. the 19th. We could do the watch party. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I think that could be a fun thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, because I feel, so what I was about to say was that, like, during, in the chat, we've had people give out ideas for next season, you know? Because it's kind of like a lot of stuff has changed since we started doing this. So I think that might be interesting. If you have ideas where, like, I think the show could be better doing this, um, you know, drop us a line. Because, again, we just want to have fun and, like, watch some bullshit. You know, it doesn't have to be a whole thing. Um, again, hopefully next week while we do the show, we'll have the trophies and yes. engraved and we can show you to them and then, uh, you know, we can uh, keep it going. Um, let's see where we're at right now. And we put the, the, the time limit for this poll is 10 minutes. 25. So we'll find out. Nate said 25. Minutes. Okay, 25 minutes. We'll find out the results of this poll. I still have. I one saw him put the drink. time in. Yeah, he went. He raised his drink. Measured it. The watermelon white claw is not as good as you would think it would be. What is a white claw, Nate? Is it just a beer? Sure. I don't drink. Mm. You got sad that I wouldn't try your drink. Mmm. <laughs> 
Yeah, big shout out to everybody that was in the game tonight. Um, Titans. Yeah, were great job, tonight. guys. Killers. You know, yeah, All that's why you. it was fun. And, you know, we, we really didn't want to like, you know, we wanted it to be more of a chat thing. So you guys definitely uh, have different voting styles than us. And the winner for trailer champion oh! of season one. Act like you're opening up an envelope. Yeah, 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 yeah. Open an envelope. You know what? We should have done like a graphic for this. I know. We all should have worn. Cats. Hold on, everybody. We're canceling what? it. We're going to start this again. Yeah, and we're going to go. Show. Come back next week. Everyone who's participated, pick new trailers. Horns. And we all should have been in gowns. Don't. What's this? Um... There we go. Is this the, this the music that we can play to like. Uh... Yeah, I wrote that. It's fine. Oh, wait, I don't have it in here. I give you the rights. But, like, let's... So, Samurai Cop wins, and that is Professor Marth Live. Congratulations to Professor Marth Live. Um, I think... Let me just check real quick so I don't pull a... Um, yep. Moonlight? I don't pull a Moonlight. There we go, yeah. Professor Marth Live wins. Good job, Marth. Yeah, good job, buddy. This makes Professor Marth an official trailer boy, right? Is that true? Yeah, I think so. I think officially Marth is a trailer boy. Stomp! You yeah. Now you have to get the trailer boy tattoo. We should do that. I've got much dumber tattoos than that. <laughs> now you have to get the trailer boy tattoo. That is what becoming a trailer boy is, and that's all it is. It's not a tattoo. It's just it's a tattoo. It's a brand. Sam, be calm. It's just, it's a cool shape. It just represents the sky, the water, the no, earth. No, we, it's not Sam and Nate's initials. It's, it could it's, be. It's a brand, though. It it's could like be. a hot, like. Yeah, that, I'm talk, I'm making a Nexium joke. Oh, oh. Yeah. He branded I don't, I don't them. I know what Nexium is. Not him personally. It's a drug, right? Nexium's a drug? Yeah, I just took two. Um, well, let me just say, um, uh, congratulations to Professor Marth. Congratulations Great to, job. uh, Kit Black as well. Um, you guys will be theoretically getting trophies when we have them in physical form. Um, everyone did a great job. Um, and it was fun, right? It was fun. Um. Yeah. Who should we raid? It was a good one. Who should we Oh, I want to see who's on. I guess Marth gets to pick, right? Yeah. How many people? Or we could write Marth. I don't know if Marth yeah. is streaming. If you guys haven't followed Professor Marth live, uh, drop him a follow. He plays a lot during the afternoons. That's sometimes when I'm at work, I'll uh, pull up his channel. Um, She'd freak, and she's a fun game player. But uh, no. okay, okay. I'm just saying. Um, and Marth, who would you like to, us to raid though? Because you won. Marth, what it, what coworker do you have online that it's their birthday right now? Is that a true thing? Yeah, oh, I did that. Really? I did that once. He was like, <laughs> "Hey, it's my coworker's birthday. Will you raid him?" I was like, "Fuck yeah, let's get on." I just had my vape. Did anyone see where I put it? Mm -mm. I think um, probably you know, like up your ass. Um. We're ruining this. No, it's perfect. Okay. Um, we are going to play something out. More. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then we'll, uh, and then we'll, uh, you know. Good night, Great oh. Noir. Thanks, everyone, for playing. And congratulations to everybody that played tonight. Yeah. Especially to the winner, uh, Professor Marth Liff.